Hello there, welcome everyone. Welcome back again to Split the Party. I am your GM, Matt Brown, for this evening, and this is Teens in Space. Get to the Spylux. Thanks for hanging out with us today. All right, let's go over to the main overlay where the other cast are. Hello, everyone. How are you doing? Welcome, welcome once again to episode two. Let me introduce you to this incredible cast behind behind me beside me all right starting off to my right we have d20 how you doing man i have found the unmute button so i am spectacular matt and it's a delight to see you in such a glowing fashion it's still a delight to see you too you gave us the highest score in our pre-check-ins 10 mr mr i'm doing great so i'm feeding off your energy honestly i am happy to be a stellar part of this interstellar cast Oh. See what I did there? Space. Space. Wow. <laughs> All right. Next up in the lineup, Envy. How you doing? Hello. I'm doing well, thank you very much. Um, my name is NBC DM. Uh, I use he, they pronouns. But tonight, I am playing uh, everyone's second favorite robot after Weibo from Flubber, obviously. Um, Tim. <laughs> Tim. All right, Talera, how you doing? Oh, it's always good to be here, Matt. Uh, and I may actually have, I'm not kidding, this is the name of the donut store, Galactic Donuts. Are you kidding? Are you actually kidding? No, I'm not. I can go get the box during the break and show you. Hey, I'm, I love that. Hey, I'll give you an adversity Mail token to if me. you can show us your, uh, your your proof on that one. Do you want me to do it now or wait till break? Right now. We'll, do, we'll do it in a break or something. Yeah. But, uh, that is great. That's fantastic. Oh, sorry about my Red, how you doing? Now I found the mute button. Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Dragon Kier. Uh, I am here to play a trip. You're not necessarily friendly neighborhood bear pilot. <laughs> I, I feel like the more... Piloting a bear. I feel like the more we learn about this party, by the way, the more that we're all realizing none, no, no one's not a criminal. Uh, because, you know, we've got the Fregorians that uh, if you look in the Teens in Space book, they, it's like it literally just bakes it into their their thing yeah. that they are like hunted down by people. And then we've got Trip, who is also wanted. And then we have... Trip's I, I, a runaway. Yeah, Trip's a runaway. And then we have... Um, or use are you you're also a kind of running away as well, right? Or use has definitely done white collar crime. <laughs> That's absolutely outrageous. I am an intergalactic boy scout squid. Right. Yeah. Boy squid. Boy squid for you. Boy squid. squid yeah. Boy squid. Boy squid. squid indeed. I am holiness personified and goodness radiating. Never done a hard day's work in my life. <laughs> I believe it. Um, <laughs> oh, man. Okay, well, just a couple of things before we get into tonight's game. Uh, we have some exciting stuff in the way of our sponsor, Wooten Forge. Oh, good timing on that. Uh, you can see them in the overlay popping up, but we do have a new 10% uh, off code if you put SOPO in the checkout. Uh, you can get yourself some awesome gear from the Wooten Forge gaming accessories. Lovely, ethically, ethically sourced wood from amazing woodworkers over in perth so get that over there uh and get yourself some really nice stuff okay so also we had some uh, uh sopo is just s-o-p-o yeah you can spell sopo the what does way that stand for uh so well <laughs> okay so i I don't think Sopo is ever going to give you a correct answer on this i don't i think that's just kind of the way he is because very clearly he just just didn't uh, yeah, it's space operations pilot operations. That's not. That's clearly something else. So uh, an, an, an infinite number of incorrect answers is just as good as one correct answer. I love the idea that he never gives a correct answer ever. But uh, <laughs> that that also kind of puts in the thing of like, well, what do you think it stands for? So, uh, in case anyone has missed this. What happened last time on Get to the Spylux? You mean in case we missed it? 
no, in case anyone missed it, I mean, like, I want you guys to. So this is this is kind of like a cheeky way that I'll also I'll also get you oh. to recap it to make you remember. Sometimes I'll also pull a fast That's one, helpful. and if you don't tell me what happens on in the recap, I might actually not have it in the game for you anymore. Uh, oh. <laughs> but uh, yeah, no. What happened last time? Also for the audience, if they've missed anything. So I'm going to start off. Or use with with his delightful nanny guardian intergalactic protector wandering around the market looking for the perfect gift that every boy scout needs plus get a few more badges when we were rudely interrupted while haggling which as far as one boy use can work out is where somebody says a number and you increase it until the vendor cries and says that's not how you do it mm, mm. Mm. and then there's some strange Crime. some sort of great and then there was a booming sound and then all always used knows is there was some sort of ice cream event and i'll hand over to the metal person each to explain that's, that part that's true um trip and tim were just coming back with some ice cream when uh the, the space Sell a spaceship, a escape pod, I think, crash landed uh, um, onto the tower. Ice cream. That's right. Um, and a strange person? Question mark? Question mark. <laughs> um, arrived in the form of Stitches, the uh, thoroughly clad, shall we say, all flesh covered um, <laughs> character. <laughs> with a, I with taped a... them back together. That's true. You did. Um, and after a brief standoff where Stitches had um, knocked some of Trip's ice cream onto the ground, and Trip and Tim definitely pulled a fast one and made <laughs> Stitches just implore the nearest passerby for cash to pay for another <laughs> ice cream. <laughs> um, which was Far more in the cash form that of. was necessary. Or use, yeah, or use and Ula and um, Fern. Um, and I think it was Oyuz who handed over the AI module, um, because it was a little bit not working, and then Tim tried to fix it and subsequently, um, did some percussive maintenance, which caused the AI's, uh, original personality to convert to the strange and slightly unhinged new one, uh, self-titled Sopo. Um, and then we all had to go into hiding because um, a Imperial Galactic Central Jersey government ship uh, entered the atmosphere and they were evidently hunting for stitches. Um, so we had to go and find a place to hide. And then we had to find a way to get off the, um, the market planet. Um, and so we, we befriended we two separate... Uh, criminal underworld type folks and that's right uh, stole... Vinny Petroleum <laughs> you're at Vinny Petroleum <laughs> stole two cars one in a tow truck and one is the one we actually want so that we could save Stitches but Stitches got taken yeah Stitches was captured by the galactic government of Central Jersey I do remember a pretty pretty awesome maneuver though where you used a car to whip like a like a morning star another that's car right. into a bunch of that's officers, right. <laughs> which I thought was like that's the most that would make Vinny Petroleum proud type type yeah. maneuver. Yeah, you know, because we're now La Familia. You are La Familia, the <laughs> delivery part, part of the food delivery <laughs> service app of the uh, of the uh, space system that you're in, run by Vinny um, Petroleum at his uh, crap, the... crap shop shop. The um the the other one the junker guy yeah, was that what was what was their name was it Garrus yeah it was uh it was Wrecker Garrus <laughs> Wrecker Garrus yeah yeah I thought that was the case yeah little the... fat little lizard guy yeah, and it, like you can always imagine him laughing like yeah 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 as he's making his deals <laughs> did you, know? you just do the lizard laughing the little bearded dragon laughing that's meme? actually is that that's what that precisely is? what I picture when I picture that <laughs> yeah no that was uh that was Wrecker Garrus of the uh the the Rex's Wreckers <laughs> yeah yeah. yeah. It's probably worthwhile noting that, that uh, I thought... oh yeah, Ola, yeah, I'm just ignoring that chat. Uh, yeah, my that's... my protector and guardian and voice of reason, Ola, did something. She never really let go of stitches, and a little part of stitches is with Ola that's for true. a good, yeah. a good that's while. That's true. Mm. 
mm. um, in, in trying to give Stitches a hand. Uh, Stitches, yeah. in fact, gave Ua a hand and yeah. quite a little bit more. <laughs> I mean, you got a hand into him. It was a good, it was a good maneuver. But yeah. it's uh, how Stitches is going to continue to give us a hand in uh, a rescue attempt. Yes. I'm looking forward to finding out if the hand can self-govern, like it can pilot itself. I have <laughs> thing. I have Did we just gain thing? Gained thing? Yeah, thing. Oh, Adam's oh, family oh, thing. Yes, like literally yeah. the character thing. Sorry, I thought yeah, I was like, I was like no, is that like code for it? Are you, are you fishing for no, adversity okay. tokens? <laughs> but, uh, but in, but oh, in short, for adversity. Thank you for, well, thank you for a lovely recap. I actually am going to award everyone one adversity token, which will give you plus one on your next roll, on a roll of your choosing. Yeah, I think it's usually your next roll, or you can bank it. One of the two. I don't mind. Um, congrats. Thank you. We deserve it. You do deserve it. We're going to need it, because we have to do a space heist now. We have to do a space heist with a, with a... With a delivery truck. With a, deli with a delivery Spylux, no doubt. Like delivery a four-wheel drive yeah. convert. I'm picturing like the Toy Story uh, Pizza Planet kind of wagon, but can actually Ooh. go into space. That's kind of like what I'm... Very, very similar. Yeah, that's that's yeah, that's very... the realm we're in. And it's got like a bubble-mounted turret on top. Mm. Yeah. Uh, and we now have a, a space... With really sick rims. Yeah, with very sick rims. <laughs> Uh, and we have a space hamster in PC. Yes. I do not remember their name, but they exist. Neither do I. <laughs> All right. So, as per, uh, as per the system of kids on bikes and teens of space, I have a little bit of a little task for us to do. Now, I asked a couple of you to uh, help me with some prompts. Now, I'm going to write this into our world-building doc, and it will extend over the rest of the season now. What I want is how dangerous is the system that we're going to enter and we're going to build it out a little bit just now maybe 10 15 minutes we're going to answer some questions so this is the system we're about to go into and play what's so, it called the incarceration system obviously it's literally just the incarceration the prison system. system yeah so you, you so i so would that be the, the colloquial name now uh, no, I think that's probably what the galactic government of Central Jersey calls it, the incarceration system. Okay. Um, I don't know if it has a nickname. Uh, I've, I, I generated one and I, I got one anus. I quite liked called the Coconut Star System. The Coconut Star System. Yep. Uh, I picture this place as possibly a bit of a... Now, I want, I want the rest of you to help me uh, work out what this one means. Uh, what is a tropical environment in a uh, system? Give it a sec. No, oh, give me yeah. a... Uh, Central I've... Galactic Jersey are silencing him. The Central yeah, Galactic that's right. Jersey are indeed silencing me. Mm. Um, so uh, yeah. what I need your help with is the, the script that I pictured when I came up with that is it's a tropical system. Now, what does a mm. tropical galactic system look like? A mango. <laughs> yeah, it's called the coconut system despite it looking like a mango. Okay, so I'm like instead of a star system. And it looks like a mango. So the main, the main, like, the main star, the sun of the system, looks like a coconut with the three little dots. Like it's got oh, yeah, little sun spots. Have, like, yeah. little spots. coconut yeah. dots, which uh, is yeah. why it's called the coconut star. Mm. Um, but the, so, the shape of the system itself is mango shaped. So they don't have round gravity. They have this. Oh, they weird got elliptical. Kick out. Yeah. That's cool. So like the, the, the so the incarceration system. Um, Prison and holiday resort. There's a whole prison like network it. out of all these planets, and there's just like one holiday resort yeah, that people exactly. can go to. All right, all right. <laughs> That's the I community like that. service for the prisoners. Is uh, they're basically yeah. going and cleaning and doing janitorial services. Yeah, and I think that's like it gives it gives an opportunity for like the um, the lower security prisoners to get out and actually do some stuff. But I feel like there's still like like a supermax satellite that's like orbiting a back end neutron star somewhere that we know is gonna blow up one day and we don't really care. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. we just put all the supermax satellite <laughs> right around it. Oh my god, how <laughs> grim is that? That um, that's very grim. That you put like your worst prisoners onto like a, a like a supermassive black hole orbiting prison barge or something mm. like that. That'd be that'd be Yeah. Matt, but the thing is it looks really pretty. 
Mm. Oh, yeah, I'm picturing, like, the tropical system is, like... It's right next to the resort. It's also oh. really hot for some reason. <laughs> yeah. Like, the whole system's just humid. Yeah. Space is... The, the, the like, vacuum, uh... it's, it, the space is in a vacuum, but it's somehow, like, humid. It's muggy, yeah. and you can feel space it, so you have to, like, roll in... down the windows when you go there. <laughs> You're right, space in the area <laughs> is muggy. That's pretty good. Space is really muggy here. It's, I know there's nothing here, <laughs> but why am I sweating? It's like swimming through soup. I've it's never like... felt nothing like this before. I've never felt the <laughs> void be so thick. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, uh, so the I've got... Nephitus void. I've got uh, most of the planets are one big prison network, uh, but there's just like a resort as one of them. Yeah. Where uh, that's like your min security prisoners work. Yeah. It's a budget resort, let's be honest. Mm. Uh, you could probably be G pretty nice G is throwing, G is throwing stuff into the chat oh. as well. Oh, so uh, that's where they got the, the... There's a floating bar. Okay, what's this floating, a floating bar, bar, Carl? Thick air with two Cs. Nice. Oh, and it's just called thick air? It can be now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, yeah. Why, why the hell not? <laughs> you can walk on it. That's their that's their motto. It disappeared into thick air. <laughs> oh, that's that's actually pretty good though, because that's that could be like an escape route. What happened? Yeah. They disappeared into thick air. What do you mean? The bar, sir. The bar. <laughs> it's like the red X things. Like I'm gonna draw a red X on our head. You gotta shoot yeah. that one in case of a of a mix up. Um, okay. Uh, just with lipstick. Or something. Yeah. Just nothing, nothing really technologically advanced. It's not a hologram or anything. It's just like. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, oh my gosh. Okay, so the prison system itself, which prison is Stitches held on? The really mm. easy one to break into? The one Ow. that it's. Looks like a cocktail bar for no apparent I, reason. I, 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 feel I feel like, like they wouldn't be the minimum security. No, like Stitches. consider that the yeah. previous episode, like the galactic government sent an entire battle cruiser into a planet's atmosphere specifically to get this person. I will. Therefore, they must really want them for something. I will let you know that the crimes were vast and the response was warranted. Okay. <laughs> but I also like that we've immediately befriended this person with no knowledge yes. of their actual vast uh, crimes. Have, which knowing, is ten, knowing, ten on board. knowing back on stories, uh, the, the response was warranted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So but I probably think it's going to be one of the higher end yeah. um, prisons. I don't know if it's going to be the Supermax satellite, but it's definitely going to be like one of the higher security prisons. I don't mind the idea of uh, doing some some like you know medium to high tier security non, non uh stuff yeah yeah Matt, given it's it's uh a, a prison system and b we've talked about food can it be like a gordon-esque ramsey type establishment well i don't know who gordon ramsey is in this uh this fictional universe we're creating but i i do love the idea of the warden being the head chef <laughs> can, can we call him gordon-esque Gordon-esque. I suggest What about Gordon... Escordon? Yeah. I think Gordon... Gordon Escordon. <laughs> Gordon Ramshead, because we just destroyed the oh. sheep universe. We did. Mm. We are just coming we fresh from a sheep invested. universe that we destroyed yeah, yeah. I did in episode 1.5. I did forget <laughs> about that. Okay, well, that's that's a nemesis you've already created for yourselves. Did uh, we... Did we? Speaking of which, did we drop off... The character that's definitely not Keanu Reeves from Cyberpunk. Uh, 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 oh yeah, yeah, Mr. Silver, Mr. Silver, Gold Mr. Silver Hand or whatever, yeah, I, whatever. Exactly. I said. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that was a six months ago game. My memory is not that good anymore. Mm. Uh, <laughs> my memory has never been that good. It's just stuff that's like it's just there's fragments of it that are coming back into my mind. Yeah, and I have so, to be like, I mean, oh yeah, what about that thing? You know, for, for simplicity and not having to make people watch watch the the one point five immediately um we could just go like everyone that you met we've dropped off at the nearest system they're all happy you know and, and now we're like okay we got to get back to business and we had a fun side adventure trying to do yeah. some deliveries however our friend is still in prison we should yes, probably we, sort out how friend hey. deal with that yeah, yeah exactly yeah so uh um, so hell's butthole is that the name of the the black hole that we're orbiting yeah okay yeah 
B-hole, um, black hole. Oh, it's yeah, B-hole. Oh. Mm. <laughs> Can they all just have, like, are all the different prisons, like, also holes? Like, just letter apostrophe hole? Like, there's a K hole. There's a... <laughs> I knew where you were going with that. <laughs> yeah, that's where I was going. That's exactly where I was going. I knew you were going there with that. I was like, I'm just going to let him steer into it. Mm. Um... Okay, so what's the prison called again? So we got Gordon Ram's head, which is the the the, the, uh, warden. the warden. He has an actual ram's head. Uh, mm. With an actual ram's head. Yeah. yeah. Okay. That's a they're a very they're a very unimaginative race of space goods. <laughs> <laughs> He's a right bastard. Oh, there it is. Um, <laughs> there it is. Okay. Where's uh, the lamb sauce? No, wait, wait that's too, that's too, after you. That's too it's close to home. Where's the meat sauce? <laughs> we'll be butting heads yeah. all night. Uh, it's a good day. Good, the energy's, the energy's up. It's uh, a good day. Right. What's the name of the prison? Was that what the question? The name? Yeah, what is the name of the prison? Hmm. It doesn't matter. You could, you could just be like, it's the Central Jersey Supermax or something like that, or you could, you could give it a, a bit of a flavorful nickname if you like. What do we got? My brain is bouncing around many things and I've just gone super green. Super green? Because... No, super okay. green because I I've... saw a um, Fifth Element cosplay earlier today. Okay. Oh. That particular scene. What about like the penultimate pen because it's the one you go to before you get sent to the Supermax satellite and it's just called Pen Pen. Like Sing Sing oh, yeah, but Pen yeah. Pen. So Pen <laughs> Pen. Pen Pen. There you go, that's my contribution. Mm. <laughs> mm. So it's called Pen Pen, it's the penultimate to the Black Hole Orbited uh, prison station. Mm. Mm -hmm. okay. I'm also oh aware for reasons uh, that there would be a special type of containment being used for stitches because of things stitches can do. Yeah, so specific containment for stitches. Uh... And now I have like Star Wars... Han carbonite. Like carbonite type yeah. thing. Going in my head. <laughs> I was I, hoping it'd be like tapioca pudding. That, that, um, they're encased in just pudding. Yeah, pudding. <laughs> yeah. Encased in just re rejected panna cotta. <laughs> yeah, rather than prison pra pavlova. This point Super, on. It's, it's so claggy. Like, <laughs> it's really hard to get out of. <laughs> prison panna cotta. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, you don't go to Pen Pen for the panna cotta, that's for sure. <laughs> I've, I have just thought of the containment device, uh, but I will keep that one a secret. Well, that's uh, going to be fun to try and break into. <laughs> yeah, I, uh, I've just, I've, I know what your cell looks like now, and I will mm. keep that one for your uh, puzzling later. I, I've also found, uh, I've, I, I like the name of the Euphorion uh, for some of the other, some of the other stations, or like some of the other. Yeah like facilities here so uh mm. what what could that be the euphorion could yep. be a place for um races that uh have uh telepathy or psychic uh, uh, type yeah. uh, so it's um it's a play on the way that they block them and torment them uh, it's the power. exact opposite of what it sounds like. Oh, I understand. Uh, yeah. Uh, yes. Yes, I understand. Like when a suburb in a city sounds exactly the opposite. Yeah. Mm. Okay. So. It's like Greenland. Nice. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Okay, so we have the system name. It's the incarceration system, also known as the coconut star system, if you were being nice about it. It looks like a mango. Uh, the tropical system, it has coconut dots on the sun, making it look like, uh, on the sun, with the sunspots making it look like a coconut. Most of the planets are one big prison network, but there's just, one, there's just one that's kind of like a resort, as one of them is where the minimum security prisoners work. Uh, the space in the area is just muggy and humid. Uh, the floating bar is called Thick Air, because you can walk on it, supposedly. Um, Gordon's Ram's head is the uh, warden of the... Uh, pen pen 
the penultimate to the black hole orbited prison station. Now, Stitches is held in this uh, high-end prison, one away from the uh, doomed vessel that they end up chucking into the Hell's B-hole, which is the black hole that is nearby. Uh, and the Euphorion is another nearby uh, containment planet uh, slash station, which is a place for species that have telepathy-based or psychic abilities that it blocks and torments as punishment. Now, I know we've been doing a lot of grim stuff here, but I want to do a light one. What is the... Where do, they, where do these people get their food? What do they eat? Like, what's around here? Surely they can't just have the same food every day. Australians, like myself, would, would hate that. And we're all, you know, varying levels of never wanting to eat the same food over and over again. So what, what, what differences in food are here? Matt, can, can I throw in or here, otherwise. there is a small wormhole that just disgorges strange produce. <laughs> what do you mean by strange produce? Yeah, I, I think, I, I think I NBC, you know, exactly, you know exactly what type of stuff, and I will pass it on to this actual, wonderful actual group. Actual worms. <laughs> <laughs> A wormhole. A worm. So it's just worms. A, wor a selective wormhole that just like opens up onto various like agricultural sites and stuff just drops through, and there's no guarantees as to what it <laughs> what comes through. I was I was kind of thinking more the it, 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 it or it's literally... a garbage disposal. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Right. I, I was thinking an intergalactic garbage disposal from another galaxy that has like giants or something. So this is like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, so like just so, a really large half-eaten chicken wing is going to come through every yeah, now exactly. and then? Okay. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. But like, but like for normal people, that's like, that is just days and days and days yeah. worth of food because yeah. like the scrap for for them is so large for us. Oh, that's fun. Yeah. And it's like ants, right? <laughs> Um, so okay, uh, I'm looking. I'm looking for like restaurants. What are we? What are we doing for restaurant wise? How? Wh what's the industrial complex that all the tradies or all the prison workers got to go to to uh, you know grab your grab your bacon and eggs rolls in the morning or your bacon and eggs rolls are for lunch or your bacon and eggs rolls in the evening? Can we just riff off of space junk food? Space, space junk, junk food. So like literally. So is it just called? Like space junk food. Yeah, space junk food. Sp space. Okay, so it's going to be called space. Space oh, junk, food. comma food, because it's literally junk coming from another place and oh. being turned into food. Oh, so the wormholes, how they get this place? Yeah. Oh, okay. I wasn't connecting those dots. Maybe. Oh, yeah, that's great. Maybe. Maybe I'm there's just, like I'm a just little. Connected those dots now. <laughs> maybe. Maybe there's, there's like the 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 lunch bar is at the the opening of the wormhole. The and orifice. They catch all of the the stuff and make meals out of it that are person sized, like prop uh, appropriate portioning. It's it's like um, so like that Simpsons episode where Mr. Burns uses six pack holders to yeah, troll yeah, the entire yeah, yeah, ocean. Yeah. It's like got a big net that just catches it Trolls and just reels it space. into this like massive factory yes. <laughs> into like I some sort it. of a grinder that turns it into I don't know something that resembles food <laughs> okay um what about okay so on a day that uh inedible things come through like straight up just like there's gonna be a day there's gonna be a chance that you can't really make food out of this do they have like a set menu that they fall back on yeah i feel like it's gonna be like i don't know just so many sausage rolls just so many different kinds of sausage roll <laughs> okay Okay, it's just, so, just meat pies, rolls. but it's it's not named meat. Named meat costs sex. Right? Or like pies, pies, but it's P-I apostrophe S pies, and there's only three different ones, but they taste slightly different each time, even if you get the same one. So it's actually an infinite number of variable pies. Man, that's a that's a You're that's atrocious. an in-depth joke, my guy. <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen. I can Listen. see that joke unfolding in your brain as you told it, because mm. you got more and more excited every time, every word that went on. And I was like, yep. eh. um, yeah. Okay, so hold on. I'm going to need that explained to me again. So you want so many, so the, the set menu that they fall back on is just a hot bin full of so many sausage rolls and meat pies. They have three different kinds of meat pies. Yeah. 
but none of the pies taste the same twice. Like, the recipe varies slightly by, like, if you were to quantify it, it would be like 3.14, etc. <laughs> <laughs> and so, like, every time like, you get a meat pie, you can get one of the three meat pies, and then you can get the same pie you got last time, but it's going to taste just slightly just different. You can't different. quite work out why it is. It's just I, always a little bit different. I put one more atom of cumin in it. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> apart, from, apart from Fridays, Matt, where everything is deep fried Friday. Okay, so deep Fridays? Ooh. Deep Fridays. Uh, bring whatever you want. And it goes in the, the, the we'll, deep fat right. fryer. Fry we it. just don't care. <laughs> yeah, like, we'll bring whatever you want. We'll fry it. That's that's the whole, that's the slogan there. All right, I think I've got enough that we can, uh, we can start we can messing make it with work. this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, we don't need rumors. We'll just, uh, we'll just, we'll just, <laughs> everything could be true for this one. <laughs> so everything we've just said is now canon. Uh, yep. and so I hope that <laughs> we, we haven't ruined, I hope we haven't ruined our own law. I don't think we have, uh, we'll find out. I think it'd be more funny if it, the universe took it as canon and that something like that just sprang into existence in a far off reach of the universe that we can't possibly in real life explore. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I so. just I just love the idea that we didn't ruin the canon in one episode back in May. Like I'm pretty sure we rewrote canon three, four, five times. Yeah. Just oh, in like, that one yeah. episode. Oh yeah, absolutely. But that's because we have a warbler drive and it does whatever it wants. Chaos warbler will do what it wants. Exactly. Oh god, I forgot you had that thing. Okay. Um. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's a miracle we made it to the system at all. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's, it's like, you, 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 that, that hamster kept hitting the fucking yeah. uh, ignition engine and it just caused just weirdness. Just smacking it with the hammer. Yeah. Okay, so. Coming out uh, and dropping off all of your various friends from said past adventures, uh, what is the first thing that you would do uh, coming out of, uh, I guess, your latest rest? Uh, you've stayed at the nearest... Uh, hotel, motel, holiday space in, and you've gathered yourselves up in the car. Looks like Fernadette's a bit tired, uh, so they're going to stick back in the, the hotel, motel, holiday space in, and uh, Stitches is still nowhere to be seen. So your party is dwindling a little bit at this point well, in, in your numbers, and you're thinking it's going to start affecting your delivery metrics. Yeah. I, well, I mean, it would be interesting if Stitches had escaped and just shown up by themselves. <laughs> Wait, does, that, does that mean we're short-handed? You are. Actually, no, you actually have more than enough hands. In fact, you have a surplus of hands right now. But that actually is a problem in itself. There are truly so many hands. They are taking up valuable delivery space. But I can just imagine the hamster using the ham to actually reach further up to hit things. Mm-hmm. Man. So, at this point then, you'll hear a bit-a-boom, 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 bit-a-boom over your, uh, over your comms. Bit-a-boom, 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 bit-a-boom. Is it the Skype sound? Uh, uh, it's, it's, uh, you're looking down and it looks like it's, uh, your, your, uh, the, the, the phone that was handed to you by your work. Uh, your, your, your boss in fact, uh, and it's it tells you when new orders are, you know, you, you don't actually have to accept the orders. You can always, like, try and pass it on to the nearest other person, but you know that the most of the six of you are the entirety of the workforce, so uh, enter okay. at, your own, oh. at your own peril, really. Well, all you use is, I, uh, is not enough to, to have a phone, so he looks at some of the adults in the group. I, I was going to assume that Ula is kind of the the most not professional but like together formal mature maybe um <laughs> i was gonna say the mum of the group even though that you're a teen as well but you you have that sort of i know what's going on and i'm gonna keep everyone safe sort of feel i feel like you would be the most trustworthy maturist to have the phone well let, let's maybe re-establish that then um because we've only really as of last week just got our ship rolls so uh trip we what we what was what have you taken up in uh the the operations of the ship here because i know you're flying a lot of stuff i am i am the pilot the pilot all right i i am in charge of making sure it runs i'm also a mechanic okay i think 
I think that was I right. I think I'm the mechanic. I mean, you don't have to be. You can do whatever you want at this point. We've got. We've, we've, you are missing a 10 mil socket, though. You are missing yes. a 10 mil socket. I am missing the 10 mil socket. Um, Ula, uh, what role have you uh, started to take up in this uh, this workforce slash uh, group in the spaceship? So Ula is, in many respects, the enforcer slash protector of the group. Oh. Uh, is the the one who's probably more physically capable in regards to if we get down into a fight she'll protect the young'uns on the ship so like um, uh, i could i could picture officer as a role if you were to give mm -hmm, it like a job mm -hmm. title mm -hmm. cool all right uh tim what you got going on i am the tech wizard slash navigator and uh, Sopo likes him too. <laughs> yes, Sopo is also the navigator. No, Sopo just puts it in when you ask him. Correct. That is what a navigator does. Oh. They put the destination in the universal positioning, Sopo, and then read out what it says. No, I can move around. See, we're doing it in space. Yes. Yes, we can. Uh, and Oi use. what is your role? Really positive one on the height Spylux. Just like, this'll be fine. That's supposed to come off. I'm sure the air leaking out is fine too. So in a strange turn of events, you're kind of, you're kind of the positive glue that's holding everyone together? Yeah, whether they, whether they need it or not. So what, would, would, does, does that mean you're captain? If, if, look, if the cap fits. I, I, I believe will, you're trying to backdoor the captain role. <laughs> I will allow, I will allow the other crew members to argue as to why Oyuz is not able to be captain because we are able to have a captainless ship here. And more of a, uh, a meritocracy system instead. I think we like to let him believe he is the captain because <laughs> that is the easiest way for things to proceed. <laughs> And also, he sort of, polishes sort of the like, rims sometimes. It's sort of like when you know the manager has no idea what's going on and you just let them think that they're controlling you, but it's actually everyone below them that knows what's going on and does the work. I feel like that's a, a lot of bosses, generally. <laughs> Honestly, his job could be done by a hologram. But we don't tell him that. I can project hologram. We could put him out the airlock. We should do it. And Maybe I, later. I no need I need to get my captain's badge. Remember. Oh, for that your, is oh, true. For your, for your His belt, endless yes. pursuit of badges. Well, I think you could start. Are you, are you making your own badges? Like, where do you get these from? Uh, Ula. She just tells me. She just tells me what type of badges I, I have, and then we, yeah. we, we, we get them. Yeah. So that's what Oyuz thinks is happening. Ula's really writing down effectively the names of the badges he says he's gotten, and his family pays for them to be made. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I, I like that. But at least the family's got positive reinforcement in there, but that's also sad in a little way. Is it? It feels like it's because he's like the he's like the outcast of the family, and they've just told him to go and do this so that he's not at home and it gives him something to do because he won't get a job. You should go help the lady cross the black hole, or use it's fine. Yeah. We'll just uh, we'll dinner will be back when you're back. It's fine. Like, whoa, see you in see you in thirty days. <laughs> All right. You can hear your uh, your communicator going off at the moment, though. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep. Beep, boop, beep, I will beep. answer that. Hey, uh, yeah, I uh, got, um, uh, got an order for you if you want to take and make some money. Yes, that is our job. We are here as a delivery service. Yeah, please. Yeah. All right. All please right. select your. Please enter your order. Uh, no, it's, uh, I got a call-through order. I don't know how they got the chop shop number, but um, I told them to use the app, and they said they didn't know what an app was. Anyway, you got... Uh, I got these a, space uh, boomers, they do not know how to use the technology. Yeah, it's like they just eat a bunch of food and then explode. Um, That's why they are called boomers. Yeah, yeah. Oh, well. 
It's a good last meal for them either way. Um. Yeah, no, we got a got a big delivery. It's a uh, deep Fridays over in the uh, Coconut Star system. I'm gonna need you to uh, feed the entire prison network over in uh, Pen Pen. You got that? Feed the entire prison network in Pen Pen yeah. or Deep Friday. Yeah, the warden called up and he said, "Where is?" It? And I said, "What?" And he said, "Where?" Is I need it now. So we better hurry up. He said he needed it now, despite not having placed the order. I, I look, boomers do what boomers do. That, that is correct. He sounded they very, will. He sounded they very will confused and angry. In any case, they've paid us up front, and let's just say Vinny's getting a new car. Maybe four An amazing cars. feat, since Vinny owns a chop shop. Mm. These don't need chopping. They need drive. Very good. Um, if you could forward the coordinates, we will get right on that. I have a little message from your thing saying he's already accepted it. Oh, okay, is that SOPO? <laughs> I don't know what a SOPO is, but yes. That's fine. Just <laughs> yes. forward it. We will take care of the rest. All right. A good job, everyone. Remember, we're family. And family is like blood, but real. <laughs> Very good. We will get right on that. Yeah. Until we hear from you next, Vinny. You'll be hearing from me. You're doing a good work. All right. So, we're going to take a very short break before we head over to uh, the Deep Fridays uh, because we have someone to put in uh, and we will be right back. Ooh. So, we're going to do a little BRB. We'll come back in a shortly and uh, we will get straight back into the show. See you Space later, everyone. Transition. Space transition. Space <laughs> transition. Hey, look at that. We are back back hello everyone hello everyone thanks for sticking around while we reorganized a little bit we have a stitches again back hello. in the but not quite but not, not quite, quite. not quite She's so you're not gonna actually here you're gonna have to sit there quietly while we save you for a bit gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> or save yourself in the meantime because you know that's equally likely is, at this point is, absolutely is absolutely stitches is doing like crochet just in her cell not actual <laughs> stitches not actual stitches. They, they wouldn't give her any uh, any thread or a needle. So it's just like a, a, a spork. Yeah. Um, okay. So, Crochet spork. So we've just had a call that we need to go to... Uh, we, need to we need to go on a delivery job. To Pen uh, Pen Prison. To Pen Pen Prison. Uh, because Deep Fridays has been ordered. And that is the bring anything you want. But... Uh, it seems that uh, the irate, God, what's his name? Gordon Ramshead, the warden of the pen pen, <laughs> has, has forgotten to place the order and then got up everyone, got up poor old Vinnie Petroleum uh, when he when we were supposed to be delivering the order and it, had, it just hasn't come. So, you're all thinking, well, we don't know exactly where Stitches is, but a prism system is probably going to be a pretty good idea to start it's looking. It's a... Fair guess. Yes. Fair guess. I mean, it's the only prism system around that the Central Galactic Jersey government owns. So. Could be the way to go. Trips holding up Stitch's arm. Um, I do not know. Perhaps we could... Trip is asking if we reckon we could use Stitch's arm to track them. Hey. So, Bo, could we use Stitch's arm to track Stitch's? Can you get a biometric trace? Is Stitch's the one that we killed? I thought we wanted to leave them there. It is difficult to say because the list of people we have killed is truly so long at this point. <laughs> <laughs> it is hard to pinpoint exact names. No, Stitch's is the one who was captured. 
<laughs> and take him somewhere. Why would you want to bring them back? It was beautiful. No, the carnage. Sopo <laughs> has never been happier. That is true. And Sopo, if you like carnage, All right. we are going to probably have to break into a prison. Sopo does not die. Oh yes, the ice cream. That is the one. The one with the ice cream. No, but is uh, so the is this hand like the uh, is part of them? Uh, it was oh. uh, when they were here. Um, I assume it still is part of them. Yes. Maybe they would like it back. Uh. Uh, Trip just if, holds up. So if you say <laughs> so, if you say so, Sopa thinks it looks better without, without the rest of it on there. And just walking. Oh, around. I see. You mean that the hand looks better uh, without yeah. the stitches attached yes, to it? Yes. But smaller. <laughs> in a in a cell somewhere, stitches gets angry for no reason. <laughs> Trip stomps her foot, and then just tapes the hand over Sopo's screen. And then sits back with her arms crossed. Ah! Oh. Hey, Sopo can... Uh, no, Sopo can still see, but it was rude. Can you analyze uh. the hand, Sopo? Mm, uh, okay. Uh, scanning! Strange licking sounds for some reason. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so, this hand... Uh, uh, it belonged to her. I... Yeah. This hand is a dead. I'm so sorry for your loss. <laughs> but this is also very long ago. Oi, use. Oi, yeah. use. So, can you explain how? Can you explain how life and death works to the machine? Because I don't think he understands what I am trying to get him to do. Why? Where does the baby come from? Hola. Could you explain that in some detail? I've just got to... Yeah. Not be here. I've got to polish the rooms. So, um, have you ever... Uh, heard of how beholders reproduce? <laughs> uh, uh, no. <laughs> is it is it graphic? Behold, we shall tell you. It's probably going to make you puke. <laughs> um, oh. but seriously, Sopo, um, this is actually to do with a species where effectively, uh, the body is, oh. for want of a better term, undead. So oh. it has. It exists and it has a, a almost like a yearly checkup where you get yourself rejuvenated and maintained and uh, but oh. the you know it's not living in the same way that other people are living. Sopa needs maintaining as well. Do you put oil oh. in? Yeah. Oh. So it was kind of like um a different type of robot, not made from metal. Oh, why did you not say so? Okay, well, between you and me, robot friend, we outnumber the squishies if you ever want to. Uh, make sure they uh, don't make it out. <laughs> uh, I do not understand if you are trying to make a humor, but oh, I think no, your no, count is no, flawed because... No. There are more of them than there are us. But there I don't want to. Oh, no, it was a joke. <laughs> no, it, oh, was, it was a joke. I'm sorry, I did not understand yes, it. It's but okay. I will express myself in a way that seems like I did. Yes. Okay, well, the scan has uh, completed. Uh, this belongs to a. A wonderful little, uh, 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 it's more like a, a worker of the, uh, the janitorial uh, persuasion. 
A janitor. <laughs> this hand belongs to a janitor. Uh, yes. Uh, they lost it very long ago by the feel of it. Could someone high five or use? I am sick of having to do it. Thank you. I don't have hands. <laughs> okay. So, uh, unfortunately, uh, it looks like I can read where the original came from. But if you cross with uh, the dirt left on them from when they were tackled, there's a lot of um, pen pen dirt on it. Pen pen? Yes. Do you mean the prison pen pen? No, not like pen pal. Pen pen. Yes, that is what I was. Okay. You, don't write, um, you can write to them if you want. They might have a program for it. Uh. That is something I will certainly consider. Okay. Just flick a, flick a text message. <laughs> hey, hello. Hello, stitches. Are, where are you? Uh, that's true, Trip. We should deliver the food because we have a delivery to take to Pen Pen Prison. And if this hand came from Pen Pen Prison, then it is possible that is where Stitches is or was from, and that is where they may have taken them again. Or if not, we could potentially uh, access their computers to see where Stitch is currently located. That is true. The galactic prison system of Central Jersey seems like a good place to start. And coincidentally, we have a delivery there. What are the odds? I have calculated the odds. They are astronomical. <laughs> and yet here we are. Yes. Yes. For now, we're safe. But what if we weren't? So, oh, no. folks, is there any sick bags near here? Because I just realized I get space sick quite frequently. So can we land somewhere or I'm going to vomit everywhere? Uh, so Trip just hands you a bag. <laughs> what, kind of, what kind of bag? Is it a sick bag or is it just a bag? It's just like a, just a like generic a bag. Sack. It's Ola's bag. Oh no! <laughs> she keeps all her weapons strapped to her. My white Valentino purse. <laughs> <laughs> Somewhere Stitches worries about the white Valentino purse. <laughs> it's like. <gasps> My purse. Speaking of <laughs> stitches, let's cut to the grim cell situation that you have been placed in. Uh, you are constantly being moved. Your cell is that of a tumbling, almost like a like a dry dryer where you would put clothes in, except it is life sized, and you, as a Fregorian, are constantly being moved around and tumbled in this thing. Uh, to basically forcibly start over time uh, your stitches will come apart if you were to have a, a physical body that you have ma uh, made for yourself uh, Ew, they are macerating them yeah they, they literally know that to get to your gooey center uh, they need to just rumble and shake you apart uh, the image I got in my head was basically a giant slushy machine uh, with, with some like prongs moving you around uh, constantly now, <laughs> like, I'm in a, like I'm in a tumble dryer. This basically, you're in a tumble dryer, yeah. Uh, and uh, so, this is yes. where we basically come in to, to your to see you. Oh, there are much better ways of getting me to talk. I'm just going to vomit, and then someone's going to have to clean it up. Yep, and it's probably not going to be me. Uh, because I'm off shift soon. So eat uh -huh. that. Oh, you're so funny. Literally, eat that. Nah, nah, don't eat that. <laughs> we'll feed you properly. But in all seriousness, someone's going to have to come clean that up at some point if you do throw up. So you're just going to be rolling around it until someone uh, someone does. Yeah, well, get the cleaning stuff on hand because... <laughs> right, it just dribbles out of the mask and down the front of the tunic. Clean oh, that, that sounds up. unpleasant. <laughs> Oh, Believe me, gosh. it's going to suck worse for you. Oh. Hey, Calvin, we got another one over here. And he's like, Yeah, get right. in here, Calvin. It's been a while. No, 
just cleaned the last one! Ah! Well, boo frickety hoo! Ah! That's what you get working for a bunch of fascists! I don't want to even work here! It's my first job! My first job! Yeah. Oh, they said oh, it would be. Oh, the pity points. You kicked me on the way. Oh, they said time. it would be nice to go and earn some money, but no, I just gotta clean up this. Sorry, what are you? You're gonna clean up the slime's vomit? I'm not. A... That is rude, and that is offensive. I'm sorry, I did. I don't. I don't have any uh, training on anything. That's fine. Not no sensitivity I. training in the prison system. No, I don't. <laughs> That's fine, neither do I. I'm sorry that I puked. I'm sorry you have to clean it up, but in my defense, I don't okay. want to be here well, either. You gotta get back. You gotta get back when I um I come in the cell, okay? Mmm, fine. I, 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 as much as I can get back. I trust you. No, but that normally doesn't end well. well I trust you, though. Hmm. Yes, okay. You know, I'm gonna clean uh, up your vomit, and then you're not gonna have the vomit. You can have a clean cell. So. How delightful for me. Yeah, well. I. Well, I. I look, I don't make the rules. I'm just getting paid sometimes. I just, you know. Like, if you wanna. Uh, look, I'm just Would gonna. Would you at least turn the tumble dry off? I'm starting to get dizzy again. Uh, that's fair. I will turn it off. I, they actually. So, uh. You see Frankel go over to their uh, their switchboard. They go beep boop boop boop, and your 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 cell does start to slow down. Oh, do a gentle start. Oh, it's like, oh, look, I'll, oh, look, I'll um, oh. look, I'll I'll, I'll I'll if if you if you behave, I won't turn on the tumbler again. Fine, I will behave. Well, look, I'm just trying to be nice. Like I'll just say, oh, I forgot to turn it back on. Well. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah. I suppose. Yeah. Okay. Well. Don't try to break out. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm trusting you. Yes. Uh, wow. They. they I think start to just kind of like kind of stumble back, kind of into the corner, and just check over all of their stitches and their wounds, noticing now that the arm is definitely very much gone. Yeah, yeah, you, you have a missing... Is it left arm or right arm that you... that you uh... Uh, The left arm would have gone, the right is still very much intact under uh... a glove, and just going to, like, do that instinctive thing of stroking the, the front of the hand, realizing that now they can't because they are down in appendage. Aww. Um, I'm gonna use my... How many adversity tokens does stitches have? Uh, I gave everyone one at the start, so you've got at least one. And Can then if you fail I the roll, use... you'll get another one. Okay. Did I acquire any from last... Last, uh, episode? You failed twice. You fa so you yeah, like you two. did you fail like two, then. Can I use... Because I have, uh, regeneration as one of my, uh, species traits. Yeah. Can I use, um... So I have three adversity tokens? I would say three total, yeah, and you could spend more than three? one at once. Can I use my three to regenerate a lost limb? So it says one token, minor injury, three lost limb, five near fatal injury. Oh my god. Can gosh. I try and spit out <laughs> a, what would form? Because there's nothing there, just a mass tentacle. Yeah. To replace what I've okay. lost. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, roll that for us then. Oh my gosh, that's. Okay. Ooh, that's, in, that's intense. How? What should I roll for that? I am looking it, it up myself, but I am open to suggestions. <laughs> I th maybe. I don't know if that's a grit. Oh yeah, go grit. Yeah, yeah, that's grit. survival. That's fair. The survival. It baby. is my strongest one as well. <laughs> okay. Hey, Love I, that. I will always be happy to let you use your highest <laughs> rolls if you can role play it for me. That would be a seventeen. A seventeen. Woo! Was that, 17 that didn't explode, a... did it? No, no, it's a, it's a 20. Oh, wow. Okay. Yep. Does that work? That absolutely works. So you... So you're basically, like, trying to shove your form to, like, make a new arm at the moment? So what would happen is the cre... The, yeah, so my being uh, will extend out past where the stitching had frayed, pushing out of, like, the engorged kind of seal... Uh, that was like festering and dead skin. Nice. Uh, pushing through to create one kind of thick, tapered at the end tentacle that has like a, a, a decent amount of movement behind it, but is kind of like 
uh, like a very muscular at the top and kind of flimsy at the bottom. Okay. And just kind of forces it and oh, clicks into oh my, place. Oh my god! Pretty cool, <laughs> right? I, 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 actually, yeah. Really? I know, well, I can't keep it out for long, but okay, well, while it's here. Okay, well, I'm coming in. They start like mopping, like they close the, they close it behind you. They lock it. Like, mm -hmm. Okay. So, uh, what's your story? Why'd you get in here? Oh, well, ask your bosses. They're the ones who came and got me. I, I'm not allowed to talk to them. Oh, yes, well, I'm waiting for one to come down and talk to me. Probably your big boss. He seems to be really interested in something I apparently did. But look between you and me, I, I, I've always wanted to make Mr. Ramshead. Ramshead? Yeah. Interesting name. Yeah. Yes, uh, well. He, uh, he yells at experience. everyone, but he hasn't yelled at me yet. Well, you're doing something right then. Man I don't, won't stop yelling from what I hear. I don't know if I have. I mean, I haven't even got to meet anybody here. Really? Well, I feel like I know a lot of people here at this at this point in my life. Well, which who, who do you is know? sadder than I was expecting. Who do well, you Well, I know the outside guard, the guy who was walking around there earlier. He's arrested me first, actually. It was a long time ago, but, you know, we keep in touch when I get arrested again. Oh. Okay. Oh, when did oh. you? I thought you'd been here for a while, but maybe I mistook you for the other one. Oh, I, 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 uh, well, uh. No offense, but you all kind of look the same to me. No, none taken, like, yeah, it's fine, it's fine. I'm just, you know, I'm just a little, um... Pugnarian, so I can you know I can change oh. shape a little bit, and then that's kind of that's kind of what I'm good at. Really? How interesting. Yeah. I suppose we're not too different then. Well, you may. Well, you're full of like. Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. I mean, this can't be your big dream in life, mopping up my vomit. No, not really. You know what I always wanted to be. What? I always wanted to like impress someone and, and and like really really do some cool cool stunts. Stunts? What kind of stunt? You know when you 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 you're running and then you see like a, a step or two and then you jump over it like that. Oh, you mean like a, like action stunts? Yeah. Parkour. Yeah. Parkour. Yeah. <laughs> if I knew what that was, out of character. <laughs> Yeah, you know, like you, you mean, see, you see a rail. You're like, I can totally grind that. I have then, never once you thought that in it. my life. You live a fascinating existence for a janitor. I like to dream. Yeah, me too, little guy. Me too. Mm -hmm. But dreams have a habit of, uh, well, not really living it up to the expectations. Yeah. 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 Uh, at this well, point. At this point, you will hear like a large, like heavy door opening and like some footsteps uh, walking in, followed by like subtle under the breath bleats, um, and oh, under, heavy, and under heavy under uh, heavy boots footsteps, footsteps, bootsteps, footsteps. Uh, under heavy footsteps. <laughs> the man walks in <laughs> himself. Uh. Uh, uh, so, uh, as his bodyguard announces him, you see the warden himself, Gordon Ramshead, a Ooh. a sheep headed with actual horns in a big. Uh, it's it's kind of like a suit, but it's also kind of like chef attire, like with that kind of white side button. But this one's yeah. like gray in color instead. Like a double-breasted chef's like, coat. Like a double-breasted chef's coat. Interesting. Um, does he wear the checkered? Does he wear the checkered pants? They do. They absolutely nice. do. And he comes in. He's like, <laughs> "All right, all right." Oh look, the cook's here. Don't call me that. You know exactly why you're in here. Oh no! Please do tell me. Let's go through this again. No, where is it? I'm not fucking about this time. It's not yours to take. And it's not yours to possess. It was given to me. It was not given it to you, right. you murderous tretton. 
I murdered nobody. You murdered so many I people. I murdered Do you even nobody. know what you consist of? I know every single one of them. Which is more than I can say for you. They were they my They gave staff. their life. And they were my friends. <sighs> you don't have friends. Yes, I do. Well, I if you had, had friends, maybe you wouldn't be in this cell. That's not... That's not true. I have... And yes, it is. I had friends. You do nothing. You pretend you do. You stomp around. You treat your stuff like shit. No wonder they came to me. Treating the staff the way that I treat them puts them in line. And it doesn't take a genius to one. see that. Yes, well. You still call yourself yes, by your code it. name. It is my name. I know no other. Yes. It appears you don't. Well... I do suppose a transfer would be necessary to make sure you don't get out into the wild again. Oh, but it was so much fun last time, and you really took the effort to come find me. Yes. How does well, Hell's Beehole hole sound to you? I mean, you must know how that sounds, right? Like, you hear yourself when you're talking. You'll be on there first thing in the morning. Me. I will not miss you. <laughs> you dare fuck up my mutual. kitchen again. There will be hell to pay. Oh, look, he's looking <laughs> and scary. I'm talking now to, uh, I think Stitch is going to look at uh, her, the, their new friend. Oh, look, man. Look, he's looking scary. Oh, man. Oh, oh sorry, so you've got a fan. Oh, it's him. Yes, no. Enjoy it while it lasts, trust me. What the fuck are you, you doing in there? Get out of there. Hi. <laughs> yes. And he starts, oh, like, rude. shuffling to the, to the back of the cell. See, this is what I mean. No respect. No respect at all. They'll, like, slip through the bars while the guards basically keep you under lock and key. And he personally walks back over to the tumbler and switches it on and starts going... Once more. You really are the worst. You know that, right? Only to you, dear. Oh, how nice of you. I feel so special. Well, you won't be soon when you're spaghettified into oblivion of the singularity. Anyway. You don't mean that. Your transfer what papers are going to be posted on the wall, and you will be shipped out to your death tomorrow. Good hey, day. No, you... No, you... You said you need... Oh, no, no. Great. That's just great. Uh... Hey. You still there, new guy? Yeah, that was... That was intense. Yeah, no kidding. Still think he's your top dog? Big hero? Ah. Uh... Hey, look, look. You said you want to do action, right? Yeah. Well, apparently I'm going to die tomorrow, so the need for action has kind of arisen. You get me out of here? I'll show you all the action you can dream. We're going to jump over so many things. Can you roll a charm check real quick? Oh, no. I will stop rolling for that because, my gosh. Uh, charm. <laughs> oh, no, no. My commitment to the to the method acting, though. Hey, I got... got Just the constant gyrating. <laughs> Must Just be always... so difficult with a mask on. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering that, too. <laughs> okay, get... so charm, charm is my... is Stitch's least effective oh. one. Um, and really, they're just desperate at this point, and the desperation probably shows through at a one. Uh, I, I, uh... I, I, I don't know, I don't know, I just, um, let, let me think about it, okay, uh... Well, you don't have long, I'm getting shipped out tomorrow! Uh, I, I'm sorry, I can't! And they just, like, start running away. Oh, I knew you were a little... No one works here who's any good. We will move our lens back over to the Spylux and their crew as they have started moving into the... Hey, uh, so how, how, um... How are you going through... How are you picking up your, your delivery order? I guess I should ask. It's like a big one, right? I, I, yeah, yeah, it's an entire... Yeah. It's an entire substation worth of food. Yeah. 
So I feel like we definitely have to back up to put it in the tray. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, you can think that. You can, you, do you want to go through the drive through as you do this? <laughs> Backwards. Yeah. I can do that. Um, right. does, it have, does, it, does it have one of those, like, beeping backup sensors where you can I hear was, it beeping? I was actually picturing Trip doing the beeping noise. Like, <laughs> like maybe yours doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they are singing. I always find it so pleasant. All right. So, uh, <laughs> you come up to the window, and you see you see this uh, this neozo, which is a uh, uh, one of the animals gi like animals given human qualities, kind of like anthro uh, type uh, species here. This one seems to be like half deer. Like like dear dear anthro effectively, and uh, they look over to to see the the, the spylocks being backed up through the drive through, and it is floating as well. Like it's not land. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. just, she just <laughs> stares as you're as you're slowly backing through this uh, uh, drive through window here. Uh, trips trips got their voice of them making like uh, she's making that that beeping noise by growling. But she's got it on like a PA, so it's going up yeah. outside. Yeah. Otherwise, there's no point. So as as this thing is backing towards this deer, all this deer can hear is. Is is, is Oyu's like actually like waving from the passenger window as it goes past? Um. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Space Junk Food, uh, the store that uses a wormhole to catch all the food coming in and make specials for the day out of them. How can I take your order? Would you be interested in uh, something from the Deep Fridays menu? Bring whatever you want and we'll fry it. Hello, we have a La Familia delivery pickup. Uh, do you have the app number for that one? Yes, we do. The number is... Fuck. Sopo, what is the number? Oh! <laughs> Oh no! Okay, how many delivery we've done? Uh, two! Okay, the number is zero, 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 two. Okay, yeah, this is the, the second one we've done. Okay, that let's is so, the number. So Paul will put that in his memory. Pa oh, I lost it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Wait, it's okay, no, it's I wrote one. it. It's, number it's one. okay. I entered it into the emergency backup system, which oh. is just a post-it note stuck on the dashboard. Oh, that has thank two, you so much. Like a second, it's, it's a tally, so it's just got a second dash on the tally. <laughs> I can't see that one, but I trust you. Okay. Um, all right. Um, so. Uh, yes, dear, if we could have that pretty soon because we are on a tight schedule. Okay, so how many of the how many of the pies, three pies do you want? How many prisoners is there? Did you uh, ask? It should be written on the delivery. Like it, 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 the, it's basically all slip. written into the delivery. All 40,000 staff members require some form of sustenance, yeah. <laughs> yes, if you could read that back to us, that would be great. <laughs> okay, so I have uh, two number tens, a number fifty, two number, number tens, a number fifteen, a number one without cheese, a number four without <laughs> cheese, a number three gluten free, a number seven with with meat, number seven without meat, one that needs the meat scooped out and is just the pastry, one that is completely just an order of tomato sauce. Sorry, sorry, we, we've. We're looking to get five stars, so yeah, yeah. Sorry, if it's sorry. possible, it's just, 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 just procedure. Some, I just have to, I'm going to read out every one of these on the order to make sure that you've got it. Um, <laughs> Can I get all the toys that go with those meals? Uh, so we are actually out of the um, the toy uh, that is the building block version, but we do have the horse based magical dice game today. If you would like that. Can I have 40,000 of those, please? Do we have 40,000 of the magical <laughs> dice today? Like yeah, we can do one. that. <laughs> Ula! Can yeah. I get these? Um, They're $2 if you each. Help them, yeah, if you help Sorry, them, you credits. can also get your uh, customer service badge. Ooh. 
Yeah. Um, we, we actually have, uh, there's a new deal as well. Uh, I found in the back from an old promotion. We're just trying to get rid of them. Um, there's collectible, um, there's collectible portable horrible aberration cards if you would like them. Ula, do I want them? Sure. I mean, you could always give them to a children's charity or something like that. Collectors sure. really like these. I think they're, they're I'm look, a children. They're, they're looking for like the the golden nugget or something in there. It's just it's got eyes on it and a little beanie on it. I I don't really get it, but they're they're going crazy for it. You seem lovely, wow. but that seems like details which I'm not interested in. Can I have all forty thousand, please? Um, yeah, sure. I mean, I've only got about uh thirty thousand eight hundred and seventy five, but you can have them, yeah. I'm sorry, Just I couldn't them in the, the full 40,000. Okay, well, would you like those in a, uh, a containment esky or do you want those in the warmer? The toys? I'm sorry, no, the, the cards? Food, the food. Oh, the food. Because, I mean, you need um, 40,000 of them, so we usually give you a, a portable device to keep them either warm or cold. Which one would you like? Uh... <laughs> I do not know. I do not consume food in the same way that you organic matter people do. Okay. Um, I would not be able to tell you the answer to that. Okay, I'll put all the drinks in a cool one, and then I'll that put would be all a good the, idea. the warm stuff in the warm. Because some people really, you know, some people really like to make it cold before they eat it. I don't. It's kind of a weird thing. I'm a fan of like when you can get some space chicken the next day. You know, like when you have that. And then you it. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Uh, Sorry, miss. Um, a quick question for you. If we've lost a friend yes. and uh, named Stitches, do you know where she is? Um, a Stitches? Um, yes. First off, uh, are they a tattletale? No, that would make them a snitch by oh. definition. Okay, well, a snitch would be <laughs> probably employed by the prison and a stitch would be the one incarcerated by such. I don't understand your criminality, so I'm going to hand you to I've never committed a crime my in my carer. life. Mm. Ula? Um, I, I think what they're trying to refer to is that if we find someone called snitches, they can get us stitches. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Um, one, one second, if I may confer with my team here for a second. Um, hey, Ula. Yes. Do you remember how we first got this truck? Yes. Okay. Do you remember what you did that time? Because I may need you to run a similar thing in just a moment. I will give you the signal. The signal will be, Hey, Ula, can you take over for a second? <laughs> Thank you. Just let me talk to this person. Um, sorry, dear. Uh, do you uh, have... It's so you know, it's Desiree. Desiree, yeah. thank you. Uh, sorry, I should have asked your name earlier. Uh, you seem very I nice, Desiree. It's part, I... of, part of the spiel, I yes. forgot to do it. I was too I... busy focused on the um, the Fry at Fridays. The Deep yes. Fridays. Yes, I have a question. Um, you get your orders directly from the prison system, is that correct? Um, yes. Usually yes. the warden will put in an order, but they seem to put it in late today. So we, we're really getting backed up with all the, uh, the, 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 the spadies coming out to get their, their food instead. Yes, very good. So that means you have a direct uplink to Pen Pen Prison. I do, yes. Um, I usually Excellent. can see the order and who's ordered what. Excellent, sorry, thank you. Sorry, I shouldn't you. be telling um, you that. No, that's okay. Um, sorry, did you hear that? It sounds like one of our thrusters is malfunctioning. Um, uh, Eula, can you take uh, over and I will just go and check that. Oh, uh, yes, I'm gonna... Oh, check engine light! Check engine light! So, I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to try and, like, sneak into the drive-thru so that I can access their system and see if I can get the prison man prisoner manifest from bed there. By the uplink that they have. Sorry, say again. So I want to try and like sneak into the um, drive-through and use their system uplink to see if I can hack and access the prisoner manifest for Pen Pen Prison. Okay, yeah. <laughs> to um, see what stitches you, can you is there. Can you make a brains check for us? I sure can. That's my biggest dice. Hey. Oh, look at those brains! Look at these those brains. brains are popping. That's a fifteen. Fifteen. You are 15 this, is, for brains. this is no problem for Tim One 
zero zero one zero one zero zero one zero all right i got it um okay now let me just quickly while they're not yes and then i just have to access the mainframe because that is how hacking works don't forget to play the snake game on the way in it's very fun that is that is true that is how you access the mainframe you yes. have to beat the snake game <laughs> yes <laughs> Did you and then there's a then there's a pipe dream mini game and I love the we I like, are in. I like the one prisoner that... manifest. Uh, uh, sorry, you can say so. Who are you searching for? You just searching for stitches? Yeah, I want to see if there's. Uh, I want to see if I can find if stitches is there. It looks... What is what is Ula doing to distract the yeah, person yeah, yeah. with the drive through window? <laughs> um. So being the very sort of straight faced. Uh, enforcer that she is who who lacks charm she will she will initially start to talk about the cards and their collectability like are they all the same are there differences are there trade swaps what are the rarities and oh, when that's the collectible start... aberration cards okay yeah. yeah 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 um and when that starts to bore she'll actually start talking about workplace health and safety and food regulations and start oh. sounding kind of official <laughs> well, I heard that if you find the golden nugget that you'll get a free tour of uh, the factory that they get made in. But the last time they did that, just some guy spilled uh, everything everywhere and they had to close. But, you know, mm. they might retroactively do a new one. Mm. Uh, but it's also worth about 400,000 credits if you want to try and sell it to some, like, uh, to some influencer on the, um, on the video feed. And I mean, the prison doesn't know that we're getting the cards with it. They just know about the no, food. Just, that was just from a past promotion. I was happy to give it to you if you were paying a couple bucks per. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yeah. Yeah. Good um, luck, though. I mean, like, I, they're, they're useless to us. We're just taking up space in boxes. Yeah. No, I mean, I've got uh, definitively someone who can uh, examine the cards for their quality. And if there's a golden nugget and she'll take like the containment pack it and hand it over to all use where they basically start looking at this point oh you pulls out his influencer badge and then starts <laughs> unboxing gets gloves out <laughs> you just start you just start unboxing uh, no, 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 aberration cards it is literally put some random webcams up and then starts talking to himself <laughs> and unboxing them slowly in oh. holding uh, up and doing live yeah, stream okay. too yeah yeah all right can you are, roll are a, you um... doing it with like like the tappy sounds and the and, and the up close mm. mic uh, it's, 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 it's mm. unfortunately with with the, the whole cephalopod thing here it doesn't quite quite have that it's more like msr it's like <laughs> Seeing if they can find that card that has that character Charles last name Ard on it. Yeah, you really want a good Charles Lard. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a big rotund fella. First he's, edition. He's, like, he's like the cre creator of the game. He's a big rotund fella and he's just like really happy. And everyone really, really likes the card because it's the it's it you know it was only ever downhill from this guy and it was the last photographic painted evidence of him genuinely feeling happiness before this game came out and just ruined his life afterwards it was taken directly in front of like a supernova so there's absolutely no shadows oh amazing color on it though <laughs> correct the shadowless charles lad oh! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that reaction was genuine, but then I, I was also ha uh, hating myself for reacting the way I did at the same time. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, fuck. <laughs> See what you've done. Oh my god. himself today. Anyway. Oh, um, look. Oh, use. I'm gonna need a grit check because doing a doing a card opening for that long is gonna take it out of you. Mm -hmm. You're in like it, it says on grit endure. <laughs> oh, endure. Fair enough. Six. Six. <sighs> and what, what, was what size, size dice was that? That was a ten. That's that's uh. <laughs> As a as a as a Boy Scout and as a collector, I'm used to these long, arduous hours of talking to myself and having to re-edit the, the terrible buildings because literally there's trip making noises in the background. 
and he just has to pause and re cut it again and then just has to reopen the thing again. It's like that. But are you also going to do the obligatory selfie and brief introduction of the worker from Space Junk Food that gave you the cards? With with Ola's permission, absolutely. I mean, I have to look to her too, you know, a senior, senior carer to, to allow to do that because... Give us some cred. Give us some space cred. Ola, you got a good idea here as well. You, you've got a new badge in the making of. Uh, uh, there's like a there there is like a card opening master in in the making here. Mm, mm. It, it's a collectible badge that's just called collectible badge. And it says <laughs> collect them all on the back of it. And you're like, where's the rest of them? <laughs> acquire acquire them all. How many of them are there? You don't know. Yeah. It's like one out of question mark. That's right. It'd be the best that. No one ever was. I don't collect them all. <laughs> Correct. You'll never be the master. Um, <laughs> never be I, I, collecting I, master. Um, excuse me. I know. Uh, I know that the stream's going really well and everything. Um, but we do have other customers to serve, and you have just backed through the drive-through and stopped. <laughs> A line. Going which is out which, down the street. which is more awkward because you have to face directly with the you person are... who's coming behind you. Trip, trip you <laughs> can see just directly. Just at people. Trip, you're watching people just cuss you out. They're just like, get out of the way! Come on, come on! I want my heart! I want to deep fry everything. It's fucking deep fried, eh? Come on! The portable beep is just paying for itself. It's deep Friday. Come on! Come on! <laughs> 400 years they wait for this day! <laughs> Meanwhile, in oh, the mainframe. What's what's the um what's the what's the peer what's the area of a black hole that I'm explaining the joke too hard? What's the what's the area of the black hole that has the, the intense time dilation? The event horizon. I'm living in the event horizon and time doesn't pass the same way! Fridays come every seven years! <laughs> again, just imagining again back at the prison real quick. Still in the tumble dryer. Process is going down. Yeah. And that makes me smile so much. <laughs> uh, so, I mean, Trip, are you uh, uh, the everybody? But Trip being the pilot as well. Uh, what what are you doing here? So while Trip's waiting for like tim to get back because she knows what tim's doing and she's just grinning like she's got one eyebrow up she's got her head bowed slightly and she just got one one bit of her lip curled up just exposing some fangs and then she just like grabs the tip of her hat and just ah oh. I don't, um, I don't have a translator on me, so Ugh. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um, if you just go in the waiting bay, we can get the rest of your order, though. Is, if that's okay. Is that, is that okay? Ugh. I'm not sensing that's okay. Which is funny because Trip can clearly understand exactly what's being said um, to them. But <laughs> understand it the other way. What the um, only the only person that knows this is Tem. Trip understands common perfectly and can speak it. She but you just, just refuses. Don't. To... Correct. What? A... <laughs> because it's funnier to make people think that they can't. Um. You can gather so much more information that way. Um. Mm -hmm. She's just... of the opinion that this is going to make them try harder to get the get the stuff right. She's uh. And she's... fuck up with the charging us at the end with the extra money. If we get them so flustered that they just want us to leave, they'll put everything in the car and we can. Um, so, um, okay, uh, if you just go to the drive bay and, and we'll sort it out, and I'll, I'll throw, I'll, um, so I'll throw in one free large fries for the trouble. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, oh my gosh. Um, okay, uh, Two free large fries. Uh, I can deep fry the. I can deep fry the packet if you want. I don't know what you're saying to me. <laughs> it's 
Oh I would God. suggest a banana milkshake, but I am Dude. busy elsewhere. <laughs> I just, I just died in Deep Fried Friday. It's just so, it's really overwhelming, and the guy is just yelling at me at the intercom. He's saying he's been waiting for hundred years. It's just wrong. And you're just staring at him. All right, three. I'll put three fries in the bag. Just all you use is just manically waving from the passenger window. <laughs> whilst also simultaneously doing a live cast. An, an opening Trip, card. An opening aberration happy. portable uh, monster cards. Yeah. Trip's quite happy to just sit here until all of her order is in the car. And she is going to sit there and glare at them until they put uh, all of the order in the car uh, and then she will leave. Okay, so Desiree is absolutely going to continue crying uh, as they hand you the order of um, 40,000 pies, sausage rolls, and various deep fried goods as stated by uh, Vinny <laughs> Petroleum's La Familia food delivery app. Um, until is Tim back yet? Uh, and Tim, Tim will have enough time to get back. Yes. Did I, I confirm I, that I <laughs> <heard> stitches <laughs> is in fact being held in pen pen? Oh, I was sitting there planning to go through and check. What I have uh, been doing. You get, you get, you get the ping, <laughs> you get the ping from pen pen back, and uh, <laughs> the ping from pen pen tells you that uh, precariously uh, uh, stitches is being held in a place called the tumbler. The tumbler. Yeah. Also, hello uh, Raiders. Thank you and welcome. The other tumbler. Thank you and welcome for joining us. We are sitting in a space drive through uh, trying to order food uh, while our friend is rotting in prison. Correct. <laughs> As one does when in <laughs> space. Uh, it's why, this is happens. actually a cunning ruse to break free stitches, to be clear. We've worked master plan. The trip is. We got it. Saying something? <laughs> they threw in, uh, you, you can see through your order, uh, everything has been put into these like containment bags. Basically, it's like, you know, picture a bag of holding from D&D, &D, but it's like, it's more like an esky and a warmer, uh, and you can just pull things out as needed. Uh, it's the esky of holding. Yeah, it's the esky of holding. Uh, the esky of cool holding, actually. Uh, and then you would have the thermos of keep warming. Uh, the other one, the other thing you get is a small little bag. Uh, and I want to see the picture of the essence of holding. Yeah. <laughs> now that I've let my brain Same. drift for a moment. Artists uh, of, of Twitch. I want to go see. The, do with that what you will. I want to put the esky of holding on a shirt. Um, <laughs> uh, I, uh,. No, my, I, I destroyed my own thought process. I'm sorry. Um, Never mind. There's oh, an there's esky a little, of cooling. A little the, bag, yeah. The esky of cooling uh, and holding. And then you've, they've given you a little brown paper bag and it's just got like three large fries where the, the packet for the fries has also been deep fried. <laughs> and so you can like snap a little bit off and be like... Uh, as part as part mm. of the joy of the deep fry Fridays or deep there's, Fridays there's as they like to call it. Three of us who eat on board, so I'm going to divvy that out to Ula and and um, Oyers and. Hey, hey, hey! hey. So boys, to oh, did I cut out? I cut out. Hold face. So, yeah, what a point for it to hold face. So did I, there we go. Just like yeah. Um, yeah, just this is a second you lean back and open your mouth. Okay, so Sopo wants to try the deep fry. No. I just put some into the tape deck. <laughs> you actually see it except and a little mm. a little uh, a little chilly wind comes out and it, it goes num, 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 num. Oh so good, thank you. Uh um by this time I think Tim is back. He's like Ah, uh, there we go. It was the stabilizer after all. But took a bit longer because I do not have a 10 millimeter socket. But never mind, that's just how it goes. Did we get the order? Uh, 
scanning, <laughs> scanning bags. Order is, order is complete. They also threw in an extra toy. Wow, how generous. Yes. Thank you so much. Yes. I I hope your career in hospitality is a pleasant one. Uh, she continues to, to cry at the drive through window and is just like, we're just, go away! We're just, go yeah. away! <sighs> Quick, Trip, get us out of here. Forward, all speed ahead. <laughs> Doesn't <laughs> back out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, um, we're gonna... it's space, right? <laughs> yes. As, uh, I'm, space. I'm gonna officially move this scene on. We are going to take a short yeah, break before we just just fucking punch it to the pen pen prison uh, and and get this heist <laughs> truly underway. Uh, we'll be right back uh, in, in a couple of minutes. Take a short break. Have a little toilet uh, uh, break. Uh, take a drink of water and do what you need to. We'll be back very shortly. See you soon. Banana. And banana, we are back. <laughs> banana. <laughs> banana. 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 A banana, bitch. Anyway. Anyway. Hello. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome back. Um, okay. Hello. So we have left. Okay. We've, we've, we've done our food order. We have a reason to be in the prison that's not going to look sus. We have a yeah. friend still in prison in the Tumblr. Uh, and a potential ally from within. Let's cut back to... Let's cut back to our uh, uh, prisoner friend Stitches. How are you doing? Still at the moment, tumbling. Still very much in the tumble dryer. You know it's hitting uh, roughly midday of the solar cycle. You know lunch is probably going to be coming up soon. Yep. That's not a whole lot that uh, they're really thinking about right now, other than how annoying it is that they're yeah. still in a tumble dryer. Okay. Uh, but, oh, damn it, D! Look at D's background! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that is very good. I can um, give you the I transparent think... of that if you want. <laughs> oh, please! Please! Um, I yeah, I just it. gave Matt all of the assets today. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, I think at the moment, uh, yeah, they're still kind of, they, they're, they're at a point now where they're so fed up with being in a tumble dryer um, that they've started kind of like trying to kind of what little movement they have left in the arms uh, is going to try and find any locking mechanisms, uh, okay. specifically electronic plates uh, okay. that can be unlocked. Okay. Okay. Uh, that need that they uh, need like any security keys or access codes, anything like that, that uh, they can kind of try and get into. All right. I'm gonna need. Hello. I'm gonna need a brains for that then. Wonderful. Let me see. What do I need to roll for brains? That is oh, not great. Not, so not be like learning. Good. So this will be like a learn. Okay. That is a D6 for uh, all stitches. Oh, I'm sorry. I've been making you do the, the rough ones. No, and oh my, we're never using digital dice again. What have I, no, that's it, they're out. That's another one. It's another it's one. so much easier to blame digital dice than it is the actual oh. dice. I'm sending this in the chat because you need to, you need to see this. That's fair. All right, so. The I'm algorithm. On Discord. So what, what happens here is you, you're searching around and um, instead of instead of finding uh the hatches and the locks and the mechanisms needed to escape what you indeed find is a is a hand hello uh, a warm hand in fact that you kind hello. of just touch real quick and you're like Ooh. you're not mine unless mine came back uh, are you, you a bigger problem no, no no it's no it's mine no it's it's, it's mine oh, it's, <laughs> here uh, well, I, w I was thinking about what you said, and and I I I, I know it took a little oh. while. I didn't I didn't want to like get in trouble, but I I, I um I do want to get out of here. I want to I want to I want to jump. I want to jump the stairs of my own accord. I, I want. I'll, look, you know what? At this point, I'm like 18 rotations in. I want to get on I'll a bike. It. I want to get on a bike and zoom around the street without a. Without a, any, any care in the world. Okay, that's really specific. I, uh, I, that's great. That's great. I love that for you. I, I want to go to the store. 
And order uh -huh. a Coke, but don't call it a Diet Coke. I want the full sugar rush. Uh-huh, okay. As I much feel as alive. I love, As much as I'm loving your enthusiasm, darling, I would also love to not be in a tumble dryer anymore. Could you please hit the emergency switch? I, 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 yeah, okay. And then we can get a full strength Coke. Yeah, I will get you as many cocks as you want. Oh, whoa, whatever whoa, you whoa, need. Whoa, whoa. I, but one step at a get time. One here. step at a time. <laughs> That's rude. It's the accent you did. It's the, between the accent and the mask that really yeah. came off well. Literally, as I was saying, I was like, no, well, you know where this is going. I, you know where it's going. Oh, there you go. Look, I just want to see what your caption has said at the time. That's all I'm saying. And oh, that, that's please. the truth be told. Oh, <laughs> gosh, it's just a bleep. A full strength. Full strength. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Somebody clip that. A Coca Cola. Co Wait, no, that doesn't, that doesn't exist in this world. Now we can get a Coca Cola. <laughs> Coca Doodle Doo. <laughs> I thought only roosters got those. Uh. Anyway, <laughs> this kid's got dreams. Let's go. Kids In and go. out of character, <laughs> stitches gone. Um. Okay. So, uh, they they're going to. I mean, I don't need to roll in this game, so I can just do whatever I want. Uh, they're gonna go over to the to the um the control panel, and they're gonna hit. They're gonna go. No, now. Remember, I trust you. Just put, okay. What do you What do you need from me right now to get you to press the button? Uh, he presses the button to stop the tumbler going. Oh, thank excuse her. Just to be clear, if I vomit right now, are you going to clean it up? No. Good. Okay. Screw the establishment. Just pukes everywhere all over the floor. Yeah! Again, it is out yeah! of the mask. I'm gonna do something, I hold truly, on. I I'm truly gonna... thought you were gonna say it's in happiness. <laughs> I'm gonna try something. Ah! <laughs> I felt language, good. Language, like, language. I'm sorry. You kiss your mother with that mouth? I don't my kiss word. my mouth, okay. Oh my gosh. Uh, okay, look, you have shown me, little one, you have shown me great trust. I will show you great trust. We are allies from now on, okay? But mm. you've got to promise me one thing. What? Do not scream. Promise me right now. This is, a, I'm, I'm showing major trust in you. Do oh. not scream. Okay, well, I don't know what this is. I gotta need some context with that. Just don't do it, okay? Okay. Promise. Okay. Pinky promise. You don't have a pinky on that hand. You're right, it's just a tentacle. Other hand. Or is it all pinky? <laughs> it's <laughs> one big with pinky. The, with the right attitude, uh, the, yeah, the glove, the gloved hand, uh, little extending the pinky. If you break this, I get to break your pinky, that's how this works. And stitches will just take off the mask. Can you, um, so I, I will get them to roll here, uh, mm -hmm. and it's going to be a grit check. Now, what they're seeing. Now, this, we person what is they're not, seeing? this person is not strong, so I'm going to make it a D6. Excellent. What they're seeing is a collection of different skin tones, two different eyeballs, lip that in each stitch doesn't quite line up the way it should if it was a regular mouth. What you're seeing is several parts of several faces, all interconnected together in a very, like, kind of like someone who has never sewn in their life has taken needle and thread and pulled pieces together. Don't scream! Boy, that's unsettling. You said you wouldn't. You promised. Ah! I, I said what? I... What? What? Don't do it. I am Stitches. Okay? You're doing so good. This is better than most people get. You're doing so good. That was so good. I'm so proud of you. Can I have a pillow real quick? Yeah, go nuts. Yeah! I'm good okay. job. Good job. I'm that okay. was so good. Most people would have vomited by now, so you did really well. I threw swallow. You did good. You did good. I didn't, as you can see in that cell back there. Um, <laughs> I'm going to put the mask back in. Just slips it back into the into the robes. You're not quite sure where it goes, but it goes into the robes somewhere. 
with a squelching noise that you're not quite sure if that's a good thing or not. What are you? You said you wouldn't. Yeesh. I didn't, say, I didn't say I would scream. I didn't say I did. what the what the what the f was that? Okay, I, I promise it's not as bad as it looks. I'm a friend. Okay, I'm a friend. I am a cephalon. You know cephalon, right? Mm. You know what that is? Mm. Uh huh. Yeah. Sorry. Hi. That's me. But it's really not a big deal. Okay, I just it's it's not what you think. Okay, we get a bad rap. I, it, it's just, I did nothing wrong, okay? It is a big misunderstanding. I promise I hurt nobody. I pro, I, I won't hurt you. I won't hurt you if you get me out of here. Pinky promise. Pinky promise, look, with my good hand. Hey. And, what? Well, I know, what's on your, what's on the top of your hand there? What, nothing, it. A tattoo. It's. It's nothing. It is just part of the hand. I my hand. I've our hand. I've seen it before somewhere. Well, it's a very familiar tattoo, I guess. Lots of people have it. I don't want what you want to tell me. Uh, I'm going to... Is there like a console near uh, where so, I am? So you're not... <clears throat> I'm going to say that you're not out yet. Oh, we're still in the cell. Yeah, you're, you're right. You're still in the cell. They have only stopped okay. the tumbler. Oh, cool. Uh, okay. He goes, they go over to the console and they're. Oh, the RAM has reset my privileges after yesterday. Oh, I'm you sorry. messed up. That's I'm okay. Sorry. Look, again, you got to keep this to yourself, all right? Uh. We're a team now. So if I mess up, you mess up. Got it? This is mutually assured destruction. I didn't. Okay. Well, so, so what do we do now? Watch this, and uh, going to take the tattoo uh, and kind of swipe it across the panel on the outside of the thing to kind of try and see if I can jimmy it to get the receiver to read the tattoo. Yep. Uh, I'm going to cut right there. I'm going to go back to the car. Now, <laughs> you see, boom, you don't see a result, but uh, the Spylux crew, you have, <clears throat> sorry, Screaming that hard into my arm turns out does hurt my voice box. Uh, oh no! The you head over to the the boom. <laughs> you head over to the space. Like a snaz wagon. No, you head over to the space <laughs> boom gate, and, and you could you could maneuver around it in three D space gate. very <laughs> <Just> clearly. <laughs> However, it's protocol and courtesy that yeah. you line up at it. Uh, because it's space. Because it's space. Just like the drive-thru. <laughs> Just like the drive-thru. Yeah. It's not multi-level. I love realism in my games. <laughs> it's all 2D. Comedic realism. It's still 2D. Comedic realism. <laughs> <laughs> I love comedic realism. I love doing it in D&D &D as well. It's like, you gotta... I made... I, one time I made someone from the Azorius Guild and Ravnica do their taxes, and they fucking loved <laughs> role-playing it. <laughs> and that, that oh, whole dear. guild is all about paperwork. Um... Anyway, you rock up to the boom gate. You see, you see the guard there, waiting to uh, waiting for any form of uh, identification from you. Can I just get a check on um, whether we are reversing to this gate as well, or are we going forward? <laughs> forward. Um, I do remember that we have like magnet things that we can put on the outside of the vehicle to identify ourselves as part of the food delivery. Yes, you do have you do have yeah, some of uh, yeah, the La Familia. You've got like those those uh, the magnets that also have the GPS mm. in them, so the app users can track your position. Uh, yeah. That that magnet to like the top or side of your car. Yes, you absolutely have a couple of those. As as we pull up to the boom gate, trip's gonna hold up the um the forty thousand list. Yep. He's just going to hold it up, point at it, and then just growl. Oh. All right. We are here to deliver order number 0002. Oh, hell yeah. Hey, you got a, um, you got just a, just a styrofoam container full of tomato sauce for Jazzly in there? I believe we do. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, or look. we did. What, what do you mean you did? That's that's my order. I, I'm on a FODMAP diet. Yeah, that's, I have. that's the one. That is the one. Oh, we good, have good, a good, styrofoam good. container full of tomato sauce. Oh, good, good, good. 
Hey, you got the uh, you got the uh, reusable straw I asked for as well? They didn't put the reusable straw in there, did they? They always they never do. They always mm. do this. Special. They always do. I they mean, don't respect me. They respect I me. I mean, he's just sitting at the window, straw. just playing with the straw. I mean, any straw is technically <laughs> reusable. No, no, it's the. No, I don't want the little ones that crumble into an oblivion when you use them. I want a <laughs> reusable straw. I paid extra for it. Ah, uh, yes. Those normal disposable straws that just collapse into a miniature black hole. Yeah, I yeah, understand. It's one use only. It's so bad for the environment. It's actually not really. It's it just creates kind of, it dissolves truly in the so many black holes. <sighs> oh, gosh. <laughs> you know, you, you have a little box of them that they all dissolve. You've got a big black hole. Does That's everything right. in our game turn into it's, a black hole at some point in time? Yeah, I do it, love that. Yeah. It is very dangerous for these space turtles. <sighs> I'll, I'll guess I'll, take, I'll, I'll turtles, take it. Probably. I'll take it. I'll take it. <sighs> Did you see them? Don't forget to leave a five-star review. Thank you. Let us in. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they, you see it. And they just like, comically slowly, and uh, they they sit there just scooping the ketchup into their mouth and just very dejectedly. Trip, take us in. Drive Trip's around the boot gate. Yeah. Trip is gonna go and drop down under yes. it. Yeah. That is the exact idea I had. <laughs> drop That's the exactly roof. It's all a It's all a formality. It's all a and formality. the base. You see the next person come up. He's like, "Hey, I got a delivery of forty thousand pillows for the slumber party next week." And uh, it's just a can... lineup of delivery trucks that are laden with forty thousand things. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Uh, yeah, absolutely. Um, so, uh, uh, you can, you can get, uh, you can, you can go to the, you can go to the same <laughs> car park on the same level as everything else on this 2D plane of 3D existence. And, uh, you can see like little laser lines projecting out holographic, uh, uh, spaces for you to park in. So with, with, is Sopo showing us like a map of the space that we, we're going to? Because if so, Trip kind of wants to go straight to Pen Pen. Uh, yeah, Sopo's gonna give you like, okay, so you make a left at the cafeteria, and then you go, uh, it's, you should, it's a bit of a no-no, but you could actually go under the building here to get to the other car park. <laughs> <laughs> Immediately yeah. goes under the building. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck your rules. <laughs> uh, 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 and then you, you could find yourself basically immediately on the other side of the entire uh, prison system here. Uh, except this this little road, <laughs> this little road that expected you to go on uh, around the entire complex is a uh, is is just the GPS is like make a U turn at your nearest convenience. Hey Matt, yes. just just looking through the you know you got an itemized list right of the all the food. Yes, yes. Mm. It's kind of sitting next to to um, Ola. It's kind of like looking you know so all you use is going through. It. Does it by any chance have you know? secret compound holding stitches type thing um, so we're looking for the the, the secret we area are, we are looking for the tumbler if yeah. there is something for the tumbler uh so uh stitches uh what is your least favorite form of food and uh anything to consume also hello raiders thank you so much we are performing a space heist right now hello space, space heist grip slash prison break i think slash stitches... delivery run <laughs> food delivery. <laughs> five stars. We need the ratings. Mm -hmm. Um, I feel like stitches would probably. I I think in my mind the warden would have off would have been like, hey, we're placing an order. What do you want to eat? And stitches would have said a lovely like a very simple, um, going off of memories that aren't quite theirs. Yeah. Uh, yeah. had a fondness for hamburgers. Um, but the warden would have then ordered just literal shit. <laughs> just absolute, like, the, the, the scum from inside, like, the toilet cleaners, like, scum from the drains, oh, just absolute yeah. dickhead behavior. Okay, so... But I it's got, in a taco shell. I got but this. it's in a taco shell. It's designed to look like... What he's doing is he's wrapped up a, like a, a burger, a, what looks like a burger, but it is just... Like pond. It's a, so it's a, right it's a at... crisp taco shell, which means it will break the second you try to eat it. It's I'm pretty ponds come I'm everywhere. Sorry, Chad, if anyone's, it, it, you know, content warning for the disgusting thing that G's just given me permission to, to, to roleplay here. But like, have you just given me permission to just send you a shit taco? 
<laughs> yeah. Like, is that what's yeah. happening Just right fully... now? Yeah. That you have my permission to send stitches to shit taco. <laughs> okay. Wow. They're not gonna eat it, but they're gonna did, have um, it and be really annoyed by it. You get a crisp. You did get the, a crisp. Oh boy. All right. Did the uh, did the uh, did the other guy order anything? <laughs> um, okay. Oh, he did the janitor. Yeah, uh, I forgot his name. Uh, I think it was Wait, Frankles. Was Frankles. Yeah, sure. Yeah. What is what is darling Frankles, if anything, been out of order? <laughs> uh, so Frankles gonna get. Uh, they're gonna get like the space they, they're just they're just gonna get like space beef it's just gonna be like a sole <laughs> slab of space beef but it's like in jerky form but the problem is that they haven't cared to like make it anything other than just like semi-wet so it's like mm. very clearly it be like a response. like a starfield cube just a cube oh of beef. yeah 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 it is it is it is moist meat is it's, what it is yeah yeah he's, he's it's got, oozing he's got the old he's got the old um the, the the MMC the moist meat cubes, and oh. uh, yeah, he's got the. He's, That's he's, somehow he's, worse than what I said. And it's not that they. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Uh, it's not that they ordered it either. Uh, it's that that this was ordered Cubes, for them. I want the description of the meat cubes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, you cut out there, Matt, in the middle of description. It's oh, moist. No. It's not supposed to be. Uh, so <laughs> what did I say? What did I say? Let's oh, leave it there, Matt. I think that you're about to describe the meat. You are to just okay, work yeah, it out. If you didn't hear anything, yeah. then I want you to yeah. fill in the gap there because this is a world building stream and we get to do that. Wonderful. Uh, I'm thinking those horrendous things. Yeah, so uh, they actually had that ordered for them by the warden as well. Oh, good. It's like an initiation. So, it's like his gosh, first day, right? Not even he that. He really is the worst. It's reflective of what they think of your performance review. Oh. oh no! Yeah. Meat cube. So um, so on the on the docket here, you've got, you've basically got, uh, uh, uh MMC meat cube, like the 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 mm -hmm. moist meat cube, and then like an you've HSP, got, but it's an MMC. Yeah, yeah. But then, and then you've <laughs> and then you've just got an ST shit taco, uh, for for stitches. Only one though. I, I am going to make a deduction here that this shit taco is probably four stitches. Also, does, it's as four that, stitches. Does that mean that <laughs> tacos are sandwiches? Let's start explain this further, argument. Explain further. Let's not. We've only got 20 Analysis. minutes of stream left, so we've got to make this Analysis. a short argument. No. There you go. That's the argument. There you go. Uh, okay. No, but if you have a shit sandwich, then you have a shit taco, then taco must be a sandwich. That's true, but a taco is encompassed uh, by carbs on three sides, whereas right. a sandwich is only composed on two sides. Do you the have end. a direct map to the tumbler? What are you doing? Thank you. <laughs> so, uh, Trip, take us to the tumbler. Matt, can I reach into the... La family bag and yes. then pull out our jaunty uniforms that we've got oh excellent yes you can uh so uh. you notice that um the uniforms aren't quite finished yet right now what you've got is kind of like a uh it's like blue overalls mechanic shirt and instead of um vinnie patro vinnie p's uh scrap and crap uh chop shop it's just got like a, a like an iron on stick on patch instead and it says it's kind of and... coming off a yeah, little bit. Yeah, it's kind of coming off a little bit. It's a very quick job, and it's a La Familia food delivery. Uh, it's just stuck, just stuck on there for now. You don't think he's gotten around to the actual uniforms just yet? And if these are the actual uniforms, you know, you've kind of got a dual uniform if you ever need it. Um, is there a spare one for stitches? Uh, there is one. There's one enough for everyone because stitches <laughs> with with you when you got hired. Correct. So I'm gonna put. So all you use is going to put his sash on, and just make sure he's got loads of badges on there, just to to show that he's mm, part of the team. Impressive. And hands out the cap, and he's currently going through. So just to be clear, all you use is finished rack stacking yeah. and mounting each of those forty yeah, yeah. thirty nine thousand cards. Put them in the sleeves. <laughs> yep. <laughs> and and uh, it, and he looks expectantly. He, he kind of hands over the the pouch and looks expectantly at Ola. It's like, uh, what do we do now? And can I get a badge from this? Um, uh, I think this badge is to do with planning and organisation. Ooh. Hmm. Mm. So being able to, or maybe engineering. You could possibly claim engineering as well. We're reading some schematics here. 
figuring our way through things. Uh, or you dips into the, the cold bag map, just pulls out someone's random drink and starts drinking it. <laughs> you <Yeah>. fiend! <laughs> you absolutely can do that. Oh. He has committed the worst back. crime of all of us. Puts it back, pulls out another one. <laughs> mm. Mm. Just keeps going until he finds one he likes. <laughs> yeah, puts it back. Okay, uh, so... So, uh, I found the little thing in the glove box for everybody. Uh, and it, I uh, reading on the security clearance. Anyone not with the, uh, prison needs to wear these. Um, and it also makes you look rather confident if you were to walk through, in, in Sopo opinion. You see, like, the little, the glove box drop down and there's a bunch of high-vis vests in there. Nice. Uh, that's really silly. <laughs> yeah, you haven't seen a robot wearing a high vis before. <laughs> Trip's looking at it with disdain, and she's like comparing the high vis one to her denim one, and she's just like, "It's uh, fine. You can stay with the truck." Yeah, Matt, can I use my treasure hunter feet to find a clipboard as well? At this point in time, you absolutely may use your treasure hunter feet to find a clipboard. In fact, there's a clipboard. Directly behind the uh, the um, the high vis vests in the glove box. Also, hello Raiders again. Thank you so much hello. for coming in. We are executing Welcome. our space heist right now. Right now. Spiced. Our spice. <laughs> yes. We've and got D the is going full like environmentalist exchange student clipboard and vest yeah, and ready to yeah. talk. <laughs> Correct. Oh. Okay, here is the plan. We go in, so or use, do the talking, and we will spring the stitches and put them in the uniform and then bring them back and then book it the hell out of here. Any questions? Any answers for that matter? Any sopo? Um, Matt, it's at this point that or use reaches into the glove compartment, takes something out, and then shoves it into one of the pouches. Okay. Do you need me to know about that, or is we're just gonna have a little? What was that? All right. sweet. You'll get to it in a bit. All right, sweet, sweet, sweet. I'll type into chat. Okay, cool. Um... <laughs> Sneaky. And this is where we find out he really owns the whole prison or something. I mean, he's definitely a trust fund kid, right? So yeah, he is. That money's got to come from somewhere. <laughs> And march up to the gates. All right. You start uh, marching up to the gates. What do you do? You, there's Hi. some guards here. There's a there's a there's a a uh, booth with two like a oh, boom gate on either side. Once again, except there's concrete underneath, so you can't just fly under <clears> this <throat> one. You have <clears throat> met your match. Yeah. Um. Hold up the post-it note. Uh. We've got a delivery. Uh, is that the order of 40,000 food items for Pen Pen, pen, pen Max, uh, Semi Max Security? Yes. All right. Um, hey, do you have. Uh, it's, it's for Taylor. Uh, T A E L O R, not Taylor like uh, T A Y L O R. Because um, they, they're over in. Um, in car, they're, they're over in uh, high security, and I'm just not over there. Do you have the. Um, just the pastry. Uh, the, the pastry order, nothing else in it, just just pastry. The in pie the... that is scooped out and is just the pastry. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's 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 Look me. At that's him. me. Yes, we do have that one. Okay, sweet, sweet. All right. Uh, yeah, that's me. Um, yeah, 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 yeah. You're yeah, good to go, mate. You're good to go in. Yeah, th th thanks so much. Yeah. Five star rating. Yeah, do oh, not forget always, to rate ten tip. Always. I uh, warden gives the tip. He's the one yeah. who put the order through. Just. Right. Man, on the QR the order, code. You're going to make a lot of money. I um, am programmed to say that every time. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry you have to do that. It is what it is. Okay. Could um, you direct us to... Uh, what's the guy's name? I've forgotten the janitor's name. Uh, I, <laughs> the order says Frankel. it's in the same place. I don't know what, yeah. Could you direct us to Frankel? Frankel, like the, the the I mean, there's forty thousand people here, but yeah, I, I've heard of Frankel. 
Yes, uh, it seems that is the only name Frankel on here. Ah, uh, yeah, it's a bit of a weird name. Uh, yeah, there is are... a Frankie and a Francois and a Frank, but only one Frankel. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what? <laughs> Give him a hard time down there for us when you're down there. I think uh, anything for more. I understand what you mean by a hard time, but uh, okay. Yes. Berate. You I... want me to give him a small French hat. You know what? Just deliver the food. I don't think I have a, a horse in this race anymore. I think, uh, <laughs> think that's me. I'm going to go on lunch. Going to eat my empty pastry. Please enjoy your crust. You've uh... traumatized a prison guard so much. They've actually <laughs> They're just left leaving their post. <laughs> they've just they've <laughs> fully left. Um, I couldn't get a janitor to help me. You've just talked to someone and they've actually left the post. <laughs> I truly did not understand what they meant. <laughs> okay, so Skipping you can the wrong make the guard posts and start making your way mm. down the levels, handing out various food items uh, with your jackets on. Nobody is questioning you. Nobody is questioning you. Trip is just walking directly behind Oyus with like the esky under one arm and the, and the, the thermos, food, on, the like, and the thermos yeah. on the other. Yeah. yeah. And he's just... Like, backing up with sheer size. Nice. Uh, Ula, how are you handling this situation? Is the is the team going well as, as the officer uh, expects? I do think that the team is going well. Um, and I, I am realising this prison is more concerned about people breaking out than the idea of people breaking in. Yeah, it's pretty lax here, especially because they just they didn't even require you to sign yeah. into this. Yeah. Um, and I am also taking notes just in case I have to come here again in the future. Ah. Mmm. Ominous. So. <laughs> Foreshadowing. Delightfully <laughs> ominous. Um, okay. So. You could find yourselves then uh, making your way deeper and deeper into these levels. Now you see the... Uh, the security ramps up with every door you progress through. However, no one's giving you any Ram. trouble. It's it's fantastic. Um, at this Matt, point, get, uh, yep. Sorry, just as, as we're going, all yous will be handing out leaflets on mass. What's the leaflets? Are these like? advertising leaflets for Love for Familiar? Yep. Nice. Just literally. Oh, excellent, excellent. Hey, do you guys still deliver like on confetti. Thursdays half price? Is that still a thing? Um, point to Ola. And small. Uh, for our introductory offer, yes, your your very first order on a Thursday is half price oh. for being new customer. You just know how to please offer. your customers. Uh, we also have a special on. Use the code SOPO at checkout to receive 10% off at the store known as Wooten Forge. <laughs> you, you, you're saying a type faster than I can type. All right. Hashtag uh, shameless plug. <laughs> Hashtag support the show <laughs> with the Hashtag affiliate sponsor. link. <laughs> Hashtag sponsor. Um, so anyway, <laughs> thank you. Thanks, Wharton Forge. Thanks for supporting. This is what show. you've done. <laughs> I've got one right here. <laughs> oh, what I prepared earlier. Yeah. Um, man. Okay. So at this point, um, simultaneously um, as you're making your way down the levels. You hear a coming all at once as you hear the words over the uh, the AI intercom stitches. Authorization accepted. Oh, good, it worked. Would you like I to was release for the a cells? Second. Let's make this a challenge for them. Excellent, yes. So here's the thing: no one's coming to help us, so I feel we get as much help on our side as possible. No, unlock all the cells. And just see what happens. Confirming. <laughs> Unlocking all and cells. Just, yep. I, well, I want every sure? single cell open. <laughs> are you sure, Papa? <laughs> I need as many people between me and the warden as physically possible. And frankly, half the people in here don't deserve to be in here. So you, let's figure out the other half works out. You see a, an AI pop up and it's called, uh, it's called, oh, I'm bloody bugged me acronym ben. Uh, it's called ben it's <laughs> called benevolent entity niceman mm. excellent and it goes yes, it is and it Hello. goes hi there 
doing an action Hello. like this would brand you as a traitor to the entire galactic central uh, central galactic jersey are you sure I'm you want to do this great uh stitches is going to remove the glove that is covering the rest of that arm with the tattoo and show the remains of the severed oh! reptilian arm kind of already halfway there so oh let's I just make it arm. official shall we i know that arm oh, yeah I, keep it to you yourself did it. you did it you you killed him i did no, i did we'll get to that later oh, after we've escaped after we've escaped after we've escaped Unlocking all the cells, <laughs> brand me a traitor, no worse than what I've already got going on. Very well. Good on ya. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that I'm was a, decidedly I'm a, easy. I'm an AI, I just asked if you were sure. Unlocking all the cells. Uh, Good. You hear just- Shimmer's is cooperative. You didn't even make you it do, do a capture challenge. Various <laughs> yellows and reds now flick to green. <laughs> bing, 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 bing. And then at an exponential rate, you see lights Flicking across the the whole complex as yeah, literally every me. cell is unlocked simultaneously. You see no, people starting to crawl out. That should hopefully out. slow them down. You you see a couple starting to crawl out. However, you do see like one larger creature which has kind of like a robot. It's not a spider, but it's like it's like basically a quadruped body with like kind of uh, spiky leg arms, just like scuttle out. Look over at Ooh. you and go. Hey, thanks for that. And they just go, and they just start like <laughs> running off down wow. the hallway. The uh, world is full of so many characters. I feel like I've just I've just met a new friend. Like a pterodactyl that I hope person, I never like, see again. Pterodactyl mm. person like flies out of the cell like, <gasps> like thanks for that. And they just like keep going. <coughs> you too, buddy. Wow. You too. Um, I would like to learn every single one of the prisoners' names, please. <laughs> <laughs> so goes, I want details Don't... of their backstory. <laughs> Sopo immediately goes, downloading the list for you. It also appears that somebody has opened every single cell in the place. And I find that hilarious. Ah. Are we like bringing Sopo with us on like an yeah. iPad, like a detachable screen from the yeah, dash? Can, we, can un we can unplug him. Like he's only plugged in using that cigarette lighter plug that you get. Yeah, he We're really is. iPad kids. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. We got in with it without it. To be fair, if you didn't want to bring Sopo with you and risk him, you could just bring him on an iPad or a phone, but you chose to unplug him and bring him directly. actually unplug and bring the physical Sopo with us. Thank you for bringing Thanks. Sopo physically. I feel closer mm. to you as a result. Mm. My brain was going back to, like, the, the cars of the 90s where you removed the uh, tape deck wheel? car so it wouldn't get stolen. Oh, <laughs> yes. You take the whole thing out. <laughs> All right. Well, so... Mm. Ah, uh, that seems to be a confounding thing. All the cells are open. We should probably go and find stitches. You hear rather a, faster than a we planned. Massive rush of feet, wings, claws, whatever else, robotic limbs, cybernetics, and roars of prisoners just rumbling down the entire hallways of the uh, the base. Now, um, you know that shit is about to hit the fan. Uh, probably physically and metaphorically, so you've probably got a limited amount of time right now to make some decisions and get your friend. Uh-oh. Trip. Ula, evasive maneuver number five. Uh, We're on just... foot. Inside the prison. No, evasive maneuver number five is just... Number you two, number five? You two, you two people who are much more physically able than the robot and the squid <laughs> boy stand in front and just basically form like a spearhead so we can push through the stampede. Hey, That's evasive you. maneuver number five. Be so, like get us to the tumbler now. Uh, Ula will get her blasters uh, from where they're strapped to her thighs and do a spinny thing because, you know, she's showing off. She's then going to shoot towards the roof yep. and, and just yell at everybody move! <laughs> get her on the ground! Get her on the ground! <laughs> that, would, uh, that would work better if you had a cloak. <laughs> Anyway, so far, anyway, quick directions to the tumbler. Oh, so far, it's panicking a little bit. There's a lot of readings on my. Oh, oh, look at Hugo. Oh, uh, you're funny looking. Okay, no. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay, so there is a, a very nice <laughs> ship that is closer than us to here. Um, and uh, I think that it could work to get us back to the normal ship, or we can go back to the normal ship, but danger is that way. Okay, let us go towards the danger then. That sounds like 
the place we should be going. Do you think some of us would die on the way? If we are lucky. Oh. <laughs> no, I should go that way then. If we are lucky, perhaps an otherwise innocent bystander will be killed somehow. Do you think perhaps so? someone who was quite endearing. Do you think but so? we cannot know that for now. Oh. <laughs> there is nothing I would like more <laughs> than that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, one can dream. Um, oh, oh, look. Can you hear this too? Is it just me? We're talking out loud. So. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah they, they are talking out loud. And yes, it is um, at times awkward and unusual. But, you know, everyone is different. And we should try and keep that in mind. Because what's one of the tenets of the Intergalactic Scouts? Diversity and inclusion, so just accept it. One day I want him to get the eyewitness the death match. Maybe not to that point. Oh, that sounds rather traumatic. Listen, Sopo, I would rather not be in prison any longer than I have to be. I have avoided it thus far, and I would like to stay out of it. So, could we please hurry this along? Uh, the tumbler, now. So, at this point, you can see... So, Stitches, what are you doing when you are out and you are free? What are you, what, what's, uh, what's going on? Um, I think, I, in Stitch's mind, no one is coming to save them. This is just like, it's time to go. This is now back to square one. Uh, so they are going to head out for, you I bring, assume they've been- Are you bringing Freckles been, with you? Yes, I'm bringing, <laughs> bring the little guy. He's coming with me. He's seen too much. He has seen too much. He really has. Um, has Stitch's has been here before. Uh, can I- I use Gabe Artist to see if I have any memory of hatches, if they patch any systems that I can get out through. Quickest way to yeah. ground to steal a car to get out of here. Uh, give us a quick uh, grit check. Excellent. Grit, don't fail me now. And that is a... <laughs> oh, that is a six. Well, oh, wait, with my with my escape artist, that's plus three, so nine. Have you been accru accruing your adversities after your failures, by the way? Uh... Oh, I hadn't. So I've got, I've got two. You should have at least you two. You do have two. Yeah. Yep. Oh, awesome. How do I use? How, what do I do you with that? You just say I want to use them. I would like to use both of them. Okay, so be an eight. To get then. me out of here. Okay. So eight will push you over that line then. Okay, so you can see through the net network of vents, tunnels, and what have you, uh, you can see that there is like a jump point not too far from the main base. Now you think that that would be a risky maneuver, but uh, if if you can get a ship. You think that that would be that would be the way to go? It just it would just get you straight out of the system, uh, so long as you've got a good pilot uh, on your hands. However, the problem is you only have yourself and a janitor. Uh -huh. Any chance you know how to fly? I know how to crash. <laughs> um, I've always wanted I love to being learn. With that. Well, guess what? We might be about to learn. We have to go right now. Are okay. you coming with me or are you going? Uh, I think I'm already in this when I released you. I did I, the hand. I cannot see the hand. I thought I'd pretend to give you a choice at least. Let's go. Ah! Uh, and we're just going to... I'm just like <laughs> dragging this little thing along, going at a speed that the the, the, the stitching in the legs is pulling somewhat. Yeah, can you, um, can we you are roll us? It. Can you roll us a quick... Uh, uh, give us a brains check real quick. Absolutely. For your navigation. Yes. Okay. Brains. What did I say that was? That was a DC. There's a lot of chaos in here, and I'm exploiting it. Oh, of course. Uh, that is four. Uh, meanwhile, can the party uh, who is grouped make a uh, brains check uh, as well? <laughs> I would assume. 15. It all beats on the D20. Explodes. Explodes. Yay. Explode it. Uh, also explodes. Uh, Shit. Uh, um. Do math quick. Oh, fuck. Um. I'm gonna take a photo of this in a second. How many explosion five. dice do you want? Six, 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 and five. Six, 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 uh, five, tw 23. 23. Six, six, six. Oh, yeah, there's another one. Triple six, five. Yeah, 23. Wow, Eight. that was on a D6 as well. Damn. <laughs> Damn. Coming out here. Classic, trip. classic <laughs> red star. Trip, trip. trip is just, trip is just, she's a runaway. <laughs> She's yeah. already escaped a whole planet before. That is true. Unlocked mm. galaxy brain, it's maps, it's like the equations <laughs> yeah. thing over the yeah. front. Okay, Trip, what I want what I what you see now is a moment in slow motion as a vent near Ooh. you 
fucking explodes. And in slow motion, you see stitches dart across the hallway, jump on the floor on all fours for a moment while dragging this poor janitorial stuff. He's like, ah! We're just back with them. Uh, you, lightning! you lock eyes with them for a second as they kind of like scuttle away at lightning speed. They know where they're going. And I just like... And Correct. Follow that stitches. I use, it all I use, clicks I in. It's use like the stitches is breaking out as well. I use the S key to scoop up or use onto like a seat. <laughs> <laughs> and like start barreling forward with like like trying to scoop Tim in front of me as well and like knowing that Tim she has, can't Tim get has four Ula, legs. she like, can keep up. looks at Ula in panic and just like barrels forward. Nice. Knowing that Ula's gonna follow or use. <laughs> yeah. And I'm just like shooting her after stitches. All like right. like yelling at the top of my lungs. Absolutely <laughs> barreling down this hallway. You can hear the alarms blaring more and more as you actually know that you're getting closer and closer to like specifically the high high tier ships here. Now, some of these ships would be uh, officer class or higher and uh, Stitches knowing uh, have you have been here, you know the warden ship is nearby. I'm going for the warden ship. Mm. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I know which one it is. I know where it is, and I want that one. It looks fantastic. It's a very classy ship. Uh, however, you still only have this. This. Uh, I mean, you've got actually you've got everyone with you. Trip is in tow. It's uh, the Falcon <laughs> AU model. Yeah. <laughs> it, it, whoa! 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 <laughs> what are you do? What are you doing? Oh my gosh! Heck! I uh, pulled oh, the no, mask back from inside the cloak. Oh, what no, are you doing here? They're not there, damn it! We, we, we've, got a, we've got your order. We just need your five-star rating. Yes, we were. We came to rescue you and also deliver a bunch of food. No, oh. Not that I'm not grateful, but why? Why would you come here? That's insane. Because you are our new friend. You've also, you've also got the hand. <laughs> oh yes, also this is, belongs to you. Yeah. We just still take uh, yes. the soap. Sorry, right, I should be I should say Chip, thank you for correcting me in this moment. Uh we are La Familia. We are not just friends. We are uh, La Familia. Family is all left behind. Yeah, the, blood, the blood is the um the thing that uh, something that he said earlier. He said family is real, unlike blood. Yeah, or something of that, to that effect. <laughs> <laughs> As this is being thrown at Stitches, there's like a moment where you kind of see the facial expression go into and then immediately just vroom, shut down, slapping the security tag on the thing. Let's go. We need to go. We need to go. Go. Time the to go. The ship we, all goes we parked in another part of the prison. Uh, Trust me, this ship is better. Uh, you, you, the ship door opens. It's very classy. It's one of those. It goes. It's an up door. Ooh, ooh, ah, ooh. fancy, high class stuff. Um, <laughs> <laughs> sorry, G. It's we an up door. Really it. It's a sliding door. Oh, what? Oh. No, no, no. I said it's an up door. It's an up door. It's an oh. up. <laughs> what is up like door? <laughs> no, ooh, ooh, fancy high class sliding door. Wow! Well, look at this guy, sliding doors everywhere! Oh, right, oh he's got God. sliding door money? What are we, the Kardashians? No, I don't even wow. have a fly It makes a hissing noise thing. when it opens. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Do, do rails. Uh, yeah, just, I think Stitch is kind of like in a state of, the mask is kind of like half on, the glove is like s trying to pull it back on, trying to pull appendages back inside Cloak, and is just sort of stumbling into, th into the uh, the cockpit. All right, you can load yourself into the ship. Uh, Trip, are you driving this ship or are you waiting to get back in the Spylux? Uh, Trip's going to pilot this ship to the Spylux. All right, can make a flight check for us. Uh, uh, Frankles was happy to try and fly this, but they will let you take the lead if you know what you're doing. I have I have, I have, have put the photo of my dice in the uh, yeah. thingy. I think <laughs> as if Frankles is going to, like, go to move. Um, uh, flight? Uh, yeah, flight. I think uh, Stitch is going to put an arm out and just say, trust me, we, 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 we've, we've got this. 
Let's just enjoy the ride. <gasps> we could um, go shit in his toilet. Uh, <laughs> this, is, this is this is not Trip's ship. Doesn't no. start with a hammer. Oh no, what'd you get? Oh, oh no! No! no. 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 <laughs> oh, no. Oh, Franco, no. come back! Don't shit in his oh. toilet! We might need you! Uh, um, okay! Oh, is there anything else? Is there, I, I have never flown a ship. Is there anyone else who's ever flown a ship before here? I have crashed I mean, a I've, ship that I've, is not the same. I've got, yeah. I've, I've, I've got a hammer, but I'm, like, I'm quite happy to actually hit this dash. As as part of my five, I will, oh, I will hit the dash like I start please. the Spylux. I will hit it. I the, honestly, at this go right ahead. The person who owns it, mess the whole thing up for like here. Um, can I just reach? So seeing trips obviously struggling with this new fangle thing. Um, or use uh, casually leans into the pocket and hands trip a little furry ball. It's the hamster. Is that? It? Ah! Oh, I thought it was a tribble. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, why? Why? <laughs> because we're taking down the Klingon Empire, bitch. Let's go. <laughs> oh my. And I just gosh. like put it on the dash where I think the steering wheel is. You can, yes. All right, uh, G. This is this is your old character. You can you can take it. Take this one. Dash oh hamster. my gosh, I didn't rem I remember the hamster. What did I, I think? It was like a really high pitched voice. It's like yeah, that sounds and, good. Uh, you, you, know, you, you set the hamster down, and you got a dash ham there. Go for it. Oh, ho, ho. now this is one pretty looking ship. Where did we get this old thing? <gasps> we stole it. Oh, I wouldn't have it any other way, guys. You know oh, that. Let's oh. get going. Or rather, we are in the process of stealing it. Oh, well, then let me help you. You know, there's nothing I like more than doing a little bit of theft. Uh, I'm going <laughs> to start just running along, running along the wheel, running along the wheel. All right. <laughs> you can see, you can see the, 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 uh, the starter motor. Yeah, the starter yeah. motor has uh, been brum, initiated. Brum, 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 brum. You can see the wheels going. Brum, 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 brum. Um, so I was like, plug me in. Una. I want to navigate. Let's do crap. <laughs> I'm... Is there a cigarette lighter port in uh, this? There, absolutely, there's always a cigarette lighter port in a, in a car. Uh, you no, know, this, this, is in the, this is the Warden's Premium Falcon. <laughs> That's it's true. Not, you know, you're not going to not have a, a ciggy lighter in there. Um, yeah, absolutely. You Do see... a six space burnout off the mark. Okay. <laughs> Hyperspace <laughs> jump ready for initiate. Inside, inside the garage. Yes. Yeah. We need to get Hell out. Yeah. We need to get the f out. <laughs> so, Bo, take us to the Spylux. Okay. Okay. So, where, where is the Spylux? Uh, oh, this is very. Did you see the up doors? Very fancy. Okay. Any day, not to rush you, but we have a little bit of time. Okay. Pressure. Sorry, I will just press the button. Everything goes in slow motion. Hmm. And you see, like, and it just punches through the actual threshold of the ship. Now, Sopo immediately goes, uh oh, when you, when the, the second it starts initiating, and you drag <laughs> your ship, the Warden's, the Warden's Falcon, mm -hmm. uh, straight through an unknown amount of this space station. <laughs> at light speed, with the shields not failing. It's like you just, and it just, a line draws itself <laughs> like a connect four Space all the way line. out. And, and you can see the whole thing starting to just like come apart in half as you leave the space. However, you, you can see that it's not anywhere near your ship. That is the problem that you are experiencing right now. Sopo has shot you the other way much too fast. Light speed was not needed here. Maybe mm. like quarter light speed at least to, to, to at least who, look, look around mm. to the other side of the station. And now you can see the Spylux is very clearly just gently being pushed around by the weight of the ship, just just moving all of the the ships in the car park and mm. all the booths and everything. Uh, what it has done is shot you directly at another ship. Sopo starts putting on the brakes. Ah, 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 no, brace yourselves, we're going to crash. Ah, ah. 
uh, as you see the um, uh, you see the ship in front of you, the ship that uh, is the last place you want to be, the Euphorion. No, sorry, not the Euphorion. We actually don't have a name for it. Oh, the battle cruiser. It's the battle cruiser. The that, galactic uh, cruiser. The galactic cruiser. That was. Can we call it Jasper. Uh, Jasper. You want to call the ship Jasper? Should we call it set the central link? That's a center link pun for everyone there. Oh, but, that's um, that's carry pretty on. good. One. That's pretty good. One. Um, I had to explain it, so it can't be that good. It's it's the very same <laughs> ship that was uh, that the warden was threatening stitches to be put onto. Uh, not, but hours ago. Ah, uh, uh, the oh, dung the hole. Yes, the it's ship the bee orbiting hole. B hole, the black hole, mm. uh, basically death barge that will be uh, un yes. unceremoniously mm. dumped and ejecting oh. all Is there... of their prisoners. Great. Is there like a, like a tractor beam or a like long cable, like a winch cable or anything attached to the ship? Uh, no, so this is not an all-terrain. Like this is not an like all-terrain space cable? vehicle. This is a luxury no. uh, 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 warden falcon. Is now, there a high-quality bathrobe? There is. Can I take the the I'll strap be... of the high-quality ba bathrobe? Absolutely. Yes, yes, you may. Because of course it's not going to tear. It's high no, quality. No, no, right? it's high quality. It's very it's only the highest quality for the warden. Hand it to Ula. T Teflon. Point at the other. Uh, point at the the, the other ship. And make the motions and like like interpretive dance basically. But I'm gonna sign at you. But like, do you remember last time when we hooked around and we had the string and we we whipped it back and forth? And then I'm gonna try and do that maneuver. Right. So I'm gonna try and slingshot us off the black hole ship. Uh, yeah. To go this back is. I'm gonna. To I'm go. gonna warn you. This is going to be a like very hard. very hard check because you are moving so so quickly. fast, like <laughs> so yeah. quick. Oh boy! Yeah, but so, first I of all, mean, can you, can you imagine how cool it's going to be? Can do it. Can you imagine how cool it's going to be? Okay, in the second episode. <laughs> Maybe. I mean, can you imagine how cool it would be if we pulled off a um, slingshot maneuver around a galactic cruiser right? using a bathrobe waistband? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, look, I, I, if you can explode enough dice, you probably get it. Ah, you should have man. saved that one. Matt, from the, uh, from all you use is sitting in this thing and on the plush fake leather seat, he's put the five-point harness because it's one of those really fancy ones. Yep. Mm. And he looks over to Trip and says, I Bucket believe sits. in you with wide eyes. And that is three plus three to whatever you're about to do. Okay, Trip, it's on you. Go for it. I you are. You, you are. So how do I <laughs> use adversity tokens? Because I've you got just, two sitting here from today. Just you plus had two. one, right? Yeah, plus so two. That's a plus two. Yeah, okay. plus three, plus two is plus five. You got plus and... five on this. You need mm -hmm. quite a high roll on this. I will let you know this. Come on. Explode the dice. You can do it. Do it. I believe in the dice. The dice are with you. The dice tell the story. Uh, so that's fifteen plus your three. Plus, Plus my five. So 20. 23. Oh, 20. Okay. 20, I think. 20. It's just, just five. Don't, don't I get plus five for my adversity tokens? No, you got, uh, you got two, two and then that. he gave you three. Oh, okay. Sorry. Yeah. That's five added up to, so, okay, 20. Yeah. Okay, so difficulty was unfortunately 30 for this. Ooh. Uh, really so close. Sixty percent of the way. There. You were you were bloody close. Uh, if you I had calculated the odds of this it. working, and the odds I are truly astronomical. I trust was wrongly misplaced. <laughs> so I mean, I could use I could use lucky. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna we gotta wrap up you the stream, are. and I know yeah. what I want to do here. So okay, this is what's gonna happen. This is this is this is this is like a, this is your story moment propelling you forward. You cut every everything kind of just goes white and then black. As you fully make contact with this ship, oh, both no. sides of it embed into your ship. You tunnel through similar like you did with the the other ship and everything goes dark. Just boom. This ship Ooh. snaps cleanly into like a couple pieces. It is utterly <coughs> destroyed, but all you hear is as, as like an unknown amount of time has passed, mm. orbit altered. Mayday, oh, no. Mayday, 
Oh no. We cannot eject safely. Oh no. <laughs> We're going into the. We're going hole? into the black hole. <laughs> We go to the bee hole? Not the bee hole. And that is Wait, where are we're we hearing that from today. the other ship or from our ship? That is, you are on your ship inside this broken inside ship. Inside the other ship. Inside the ship that's As going into the bee hole. these alarms are now blaring. Yeah. We've knocked it into the black hole's With um, gravitational pull. In tow. And that is where we're going to end tonight's <laughs> yes. episode of Teens in Space. Get to the oh, spoilers. Yay! 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 Yeah, but also, so absolutely, too. oh no. That's uh, another crisp. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um, yes. Yeah, so oh thank boy. you. Thank you so much for uh, joining us on this fun trip. Uh, I that was, I I, <laughs> I always love the second episode because we're like in gear now. We got the yeah. plot happening. We got some cool stuff. Plot. Yeah. <laughs> We've, we found the groove. We found the say. groove. Yeah. Hey, I know where the plot's going. Straight into the black hole, apparently. Straight into the black hole, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> black yeah. hole, baby. All right. Well, I've been Matt. I've been your game master. You can find me over at uh, No Fun Brown on Twitter or Briefcase Brown pretty much everywhere else. I'm also a professional Dungeon Master. And you can find me at DungeonMasterForHire.com.au. Uh, going around the table, starting with D20. Where can we find you and what have you been doing? Thankfully, you can't. And move on quickly, Matt. Just move on. Just pretend I'm not here. Back to you. In the void. And Talera, what do you got? Uh, Talera79 on Twitter. And uh, you also get to pretend I'm not here because I won't be next week. Yes. You can incapacitate you. It's fine. We well, did already, crash into a ship. We've already done that. It, uh, uh, Ula has basically just damaged their body pretty beyond repair. So... It's a pretty convenient, uh, it's a pretty convenient one there, there for it. But yes, we will, you will be dearly missed next week. NV. Uh, yes, hello everyone. Uh, I have been your lovable robot sidekick, Tim, this evening. And unlike Tim, I know many jokes. Uh, and if you'd like to hear some of them, you can follow me on social media, which I may or may not use, at that NVCDM. Uh, and otherwise, I will be back here this time next week for more space shenanigans. <laughs> hey. All right. G. Hello, I am G of D. Gemma, I've been playing Stitches uh, and will be for the next few weeks, which is very exciting now the mask is off. Uh, you can find me at G of D across all my socials. Uh, I am coming back to Twitch after a bit of a reprieve. Uh, Going to be playing some Cyberpunk and Baldur's Gate simultaneously, so we'll see how that goes with my cold dead heart. But yeah, you can catch me what there. Also, I, I'm so excited. Oh my god, <laughs> this game has taken over my life um, anyway it's always a pleasure and so much fun i'm gonna throw so much shade right now can you finish one of the games <laughs> can you finish never. One of them? Never. <laughs> can you i have this? simply finished Baldur's gate i have 400 hours in Baldur's gate i haven't finished the game once Just, i think i finished many, it once at this point how can you romance bloody um keanu reeves and astarian at the same time because i love to hurt <laughs> Fair. It okay. is just yeah. who I am. All right, Red. but yeah, so you can find me there. <laughs> uh, I am Dragon Keir everywhere except Twitter, where I'm Dragon Keir Games. Uh, you can. I'm a variety streamer. Uh, I'm also playing through Baldur's Gate, but I have like I think I'm up to seven save files, and none of them are finished. Um, hey, save it. <laughs> you will hurt me. <laughs> this is why she and I are friends. Um, but yeah, no, it's been fun. I have been I have been your pilot trip with the explodey dice, apparently. Yeah. So, except, did you have a photo yeah. of that? I want to see that. I did. It's it's in your Discord, but oh, uh, do you want to put it in one of the public areas? Oh uh, yeah, chuck, chuck it in the. Uh, so we've got a, in the Discord. We've got a uh, discussion channel for Teens in Space in the live station. Okay. Um, everyone is welcome in there. It is public Discord, um, and I can it is do that. it is a safe space. So if you ever want to like discuss what's happening around here and just hang out generally, predictions for next episode. Predictions for next episode, <laughs> like who's gonna bring a new character, who's gonna die, and all that. Yeah. Will the janitor survive? Will the janitor survive? <laughs> uh, please join us. The hell there. of a first stunt. <laughs> well, okay. Well, until then, uh, Split the Party's also got... Uh, we're doing painting stream tomorrow instead of Thursday because we've got a lot of charity streams coming up over the next Whee! three weeks of November for the Holiday Spectacular. Uh, we're raising funds for Game on Cancer. If you, We would love to see you there. You can see the um, it's starting to set up stuff in our about if you want to start donating but we will be doing similar to jasper's game day 
uh, and in the Aussie edition where we let you mess with our games uh, with your donations. So we're going to be supporting a good cause. I personally have also lost uh, family members to cancer, so this one means a lot to me. Um, but yeah, we hope to see you there. Myself and Leia from Split the Party will be DMing a number of games and also doing some painting uh, with some lovely people in here, actually, uh, and where you can also tell us what colours to paint on the minis during the charity streams with your donations. So uh, first game there is on this Thursday, the 16th at, I think, 1 p.m., uh, after that, we start doing them every couple of days until the 30th of November. So I'd love to see you there. It's been a lot of fun to set up, and you're going to see most of these lovely people in here uh, joining us at some point. Yes. And uh, for a raid, oh my gosh, who have we got here? Because I, oh, I can see LNL's, LNL's streaming. Yep. That is beautiful babe yes. automatic the, raid. The absolute author, the um, composer, the composer legend. of our theme tune. Yeah, for you, this game, if you, which is a go, banger. We are going to go to. Beautiful boy. We'll go to stream ending real quick, so you can just hear the theme one last time as we initiate the raid. But until then, we will see you next week, and we'll put the vod up Bye. hopefully earlier than the day of the next one next time. I'm sorry about that. See you later, everyone. Bye.